Hey everybody, welcome to Community Service Podcast, where it looks like my cat's pregnant, but I've just been feeding her too much. <laughs> Boo, Every all our neighbors are like, is she pregnant? Look how cute this little cat is. She's so cute. Anyways, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I love you all. You've been showing up to my shows. We got tour dates galore. I got Murrieta, California. I'm doing it again December 18th. We got Philadelphia, uh, New York, Connecticut, freaking... Poughkeepsie, New York, Levi Town. I don't know, it's like Long Island. I'm coming your way, baby. Phoenix, we coming back, baby. Let's let's do some <laughs> I got some new material. I got about 30 minutes of that shit. It's hard though. It's hard. Like some of it times it kills, sometimes it doesn't. I'm like, I don't know. It's really hard. Anyways, we got new shit. I love you all. Thank you for showing up to my shows, liking my podcast, subscribing. Today's guest is Sarah Highland. She is funny as f- She's a true weirdo like myself, and God damn it, I love I love me some weirdos. And you shall see, we get weird, baby. We talk about farts a lot. I don't think we keep one train of thought for longer than a <laughs> second. It's fantastic. You got ADD? I do. She got ADD? She do. We all do. This is the ADD today. Anyways, thank you. Tune in right now. She's hilarious. Check her out right now. Peace and love. I like wearing these big old things too. These are, I know, we could hear. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Move your little, yeah. Move Hello, your microphono. Yeah. Oh, you got it? How'd you know I was Mexican? <laughs> El microphono. <laughs> I was no. brushing up on my Espanolo. You want to take some drugs, man? <laughs> what do you got there? I got some C- fucking Crego? ashwagandha, skull cap, edelberry. What else is in it? It finally came in. So I'm addicted to this shit. Okay. Um, Finger leaf morning glory root. What the fuck is that? Finger leaf. Finger leaf. Hey, let me get a finger leaf morning glory root. I need some for my anxiety. (laughs) Me and, uh, uh, uh. Uh, why can't I think of his name? Josh, um, Adam Myers. I love that fucking yeah, weirdo. Yeah, I love him so much. I'm sorry, because I'm usually very loud, and so I try to give <laughs> your audience, your I'm listening. super excited, too, to have you on, because you're a weirdo. It's, I'm, so, I'm a, yeah. so weird, too. Weirdos it's, are the best. They're kind of dope these days. They're the best. But yeah, we used to, um, so I used to run into Josh. Okay, so I used to work over in Hollywood, and I'd go to that fucking Air One over on Beverly. It's fancy. <laughs> so fancy, like... I went into great debt because of everyone. I didn't mean to, but I was trying to get healthy. Damn it. And so I would run into Josh. He's like, hey, dude. I was like, what's up? He's like, I just got this drink. It has lion's mane in it. I was like, lion's mane? (laughs) I literally thought it was the mane of a lion. I was like, dude. What? He's That's like, yeah. He's cool, like, man. They're hunting lions and make you juice. <laughs> That's what I thought. He's like, dude, it's like 36 bucks. So I was like, dope. What's it do? But it turns out it's like, it's just a mushroom. <laughs> but I thought, I was like, dude, do they just go pluck the mane and just like powder it? Drizz-? It was crazy. Anyway, they, so mushrooms. They, I want, yeah, it's a mushroom. I know. I've watched that documentary, the. On Netflix, finally, the magical world of mushrooms. What the hell is it called? Did you watch that shit? I didn't watch. I've watched everything on Netflix except for the mushroom show. <laughs> it's so show. good. There's so many mushrooms that can help us that don't get you high. Yeah. No, I know. Yeah. There, there's Red a whole... reishi mushroom. It's supposed Re- to have anti-cancer properties. I believe. Uh, reishi, reishi is anti, uh, anti, every, uh, anti. I'm, I'm 92. You are? And I, You're on that I, Rishi? I, I, I Rishi every day. I'm 84. I'm on, yeah. that, I'm on that morning glory. <laughs> You're on that route. finger licking shit. <laughs> finger licking or good morning glory. I know when we were, you said the Ashgawanda. Ashwagandha. I call it a- Ashgawanda. Gatu cola. Leaf. And then I thought, what did you say? What else did you say this morning? I was like, oh, sure. What is that? And it's actually a place. What did you call it? Oh, I said, you know, Ayurvedic. So you're like, yeah, I take that pill. I, was like, no. <laughs> I didn't say I take that pill. You lied. Throw me under the bus. I didn't say. That. I, I said, oh shit, I heard, what is that? Is that what, a vitamin? Yeah. That's what I said. You I said, could take it. You said Budapest, and then I said, yeah, that's what my sister said. I take me. Russia. I love Russia. <laughs> is that in Russia? Yes. I have no idea. No, I don't know. <laughs> I'll take, I take, I take Japanese. Oh, this shit. All right. Hi, Craig. Hello. It's so funny that you also bring up Josh Adam Myers because he's also s- sober. And it's always the sober people looking for something that's not drugs to get them high, you know. Not that, that this doesn't get you high. This calms you down. That's why I love it. It just turns your thoughts just like. 
In the silk. In the silk. <laughs> does it? Does it? You saw my silky it, pillow. I feel it when you said that. I was like, oh, I wonder if it's like when you like uh, you uh, amplify the font on your phone, like you make it bigger, make it bigger, so it's that is, clear. I my font was so down. big for so long that I got made fun of by all my friends <laughs> that I now made it back to small. <laughs> you made. I was tired of it. <laughs> you made it micro. So, I'm like, I'm 84. I never want to do it too, but. It just, I don't know. It makes it, whatever. I'm in no shame of getting older. It's all good. And I know, I, I actually watched um, oh, Dana Moon. You guys were talking about. I sober. love you Dana You have a Moon. lot of sober people on here. Yeah, everybody's sober or not sober. They're always a revolving door in the stand-up world. That's of, true. Of, uh, That's true. Of you should be sober. <laughs> 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 or uh, I hope you don't relapse. <laughs> 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 you're dumb feet Fuck it. god our business is full of nuts you know it's crazy but you're not you're sober not sober you yeah say, like, i started California. smoking weed yeah, yeah, yeah but very recent i was when i was 100 percent for almost eight years yeah you tell and me then that. the pandemic happened yeah, like, give me this give me the morning glory we lost no, a this, lot of y'all during yeah, the pandemic yeah. that's okay that's no, okay. my I, my thoughts on that is, mm -hmm. like, obviously, I don't think I'm 100% sober because weed counts. Weed get, like, I'm already addicted to that. I know, but, you know, I still pay the bills. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't like it. Like, in the program, a lot of people, like, you're allowed to take head meds. And some even, like, are allowed to take Valium if you have a panic attack. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, dude, you're taking volume, but you're judging me for marijuana. You know, that's my shit. Like, I respect and and value, I don't know, the thoughts and opinions of someone that's it's 100 or nothing, mm -hmm. as opposed to like, oh, wait, these benzos are okay because my doctor <laughs> gave them to me. Right. You know, right. that's when I get like, it's one or the other. There's a little, you know, if you get a little gray area, you give me a little gray area. Or if you want to be honest about it, you ain't sober either, motherfucker. Because you own that Benzos. <laughs> Everybody's got their own. <laughs> the well, that's what, okay, right? There'll but... be people in the program that say they're sober and they're on Adderall. I'm like, no, you're on real. fucking meth, bro. <laughs> you're on meth. Yeah, and you're yeah. you, you got love you're sober. That's a God made it. Came out of her wee wee. Yeah, God's a woman. Her wee wee. Well, well, I mean, that's the thing, though. Like, I think, when we were just talking about coffee, coffee's fucked up, too. Like, coffee ain't, oh, coffee. Coffee ain't an innocent drug. Fine. I've had 16 of these this morning. Coffee's made and me want to kill myself. A little bit, but I go for that. Do you know what yeah, I mean? I know like, me too. it's okay. I cleared my system yeah. of any kind of food so I can have the greatest high possible. But, like, I, so you could argue it. You know what I'm I saying? Did, I did. It's so funny you say that because I did that with opioids. I'm like, I want an empty stomach. Yeah. I want this yeah. Oxycontin Fill to hit up, me but, hard. And uh, now I do that with coffee. <laughs> on nothing. I w I'll go to sleep. Just can't wait. I can't wake up. I can't. I mean, I can't wait to wake up. I can't wake up. I'm, a, I'm dead. <laughs> no, that was dark. Anyhow. Wake I, up and drink coffee. Yes, I can't wait to wake up and drink coffee. Thank you for saving me because I just went down a dark spot. <laughs> That's okay. Come on back. I'll go down there with you. Don't even sweat it. I don't even know what you're drinking. How many of these have you this had? This is matcha. <laughs> Only two. No, just two. Matcha. No. And so this see, this gets you up and, and makes your brain go, ah! And then this brings you brings back down. You down. I like uppers and downers, but now I got to do it with matcha and ashwagandha. <laughs> and ashwagandha. As, as opposed to meth and uh, fucking heroin, you know. <laughs> we see, we're all, we do, people don't change. It's all good, dude. You seem pumped. You seem all yeah. right. You seem comfortable in your own skin. You I right? am. I'm in the car. Huh? Me and you. Me and you in our car. I'm, I'm a lesbian. What the fuck? I know it dropped below seventy here, so I'm like, go, girl. God. So I've been wearing them ever since. They're th they're thick. They're thick. You they're don't good. move a lot. I know they're stiff as a board. It's you right. could get them pre uh, broken in. You just uh, buy them used off of that's the point sweaty though, they're, man. they're made for like working you yeah, know you they're, work. you, they're supposed to be worked in but everybody in la goes you know we just <laughs> get them get them <laughs> post worked we're like mm. <laughs> so i was so excited because i love carhartt just because i like tools and shit yeah and uh and then i saw a carhartt coming to la brea on la brea 
in Los Angeles. A Carhartt store. And I, yeah, and I got all excited and I went. And it was the Carhartt. The Carhartt sold half of its factory to Europe in the whatever, Uh 80s. And they made it like streetwear Euro designer. What does so, that even mean? Like taper pants? Like skinny jeans? I don't even skinny know. Pants? Just like <laughs> skinny just tapered Carhartt pants? meets Melrose Avenue, you know? Oh, no. And But it was like triple price and not like this. Not like, I was like, I'm not paying fucking that much for that jacket and it'll get a scuff, you know? A scuff mark. A scuff. I don't want no scuff on my $200 <laughs> on jacket. And the, anyways, it's I a fake car heart. Don't believe them. I won't. Dude. Don't believe I don't even em. go over that. Yeah, area. fuck La Brea. I don't go over that. <laughs> I hate tar pits. Hell no. Yeah, it's they too killed much. the dinosaurs. <laughs> they did. <laughs> <laughs> you do go dark. You like death. It's cool. It's I cool. Did, I did. What are you talking? Oh, oh I oh. broke. I killed my glass. He said too many <laughs> tranquil minds can't control his. <laughs> oh, because they haven't kicked in yet. I just took them. I love them tranquil my I just ordered those. The ones I was taking were three years expired. I don't even know what real Shut shit. Because my sister gave me these because I'm riddled with mind problems. Uh-huh. <laughs> no. And I'm like, no, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm fine in my head. I don't need your help. So they just sat on a shelf and expired. All right. And then I and then I started taking yeah. them expired. And then I was like, oh my God, these are lovely. <laughs> I'm not living in my it's mind. Like old school weed, it's like yeah. pencil shavings. Yeah, it's not really. Do you remember? <laughs> I was talking to somebody about this the other I day. S- you I, smoke pencil shavings? When no, when I was when I smoked weed, I've been sober for 19 years, like a long time. So, but when I smoked weed, it was the time. It wasn't like it. I mean, I sound like a grandma, but it like wasn't no, like it was what different. it is now. Yeah, you bought it. It was shady as fuck. <laughs> you well, always you're... bought it in like the sandwich bags, and it was the it was it was. It, it looked like you smashed it in a book. It was. <laughs> well, wait, it wait, was where are you t- from? Kentucky. That's why. Yeah, you're right. Oh, you're I, as, ca- you, as, you, as you're explaining you're it, I was like, wait a minute. I don't know what you're talking about. We Even ha- back then, you we guys had, had opt- that? We had the option to buy that, but I did it. The option. I did it once. That was prime, prime shit right there. <laughs> oh, no. We had Kush. <laughs> I came up on Kush. Well, Kush, to, again, this is memory, right? Kush to me, like the, it was like you hit the pot of gold when it was like sticky and red but that that was like annual like it was once a year yeah that that happened and it was like it was the, the one top dog guy who had it. it in yeah 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 other than that you're smoking the stem like pop Whoa. pop pop all the seeds like that was all the seeds popping i smoked stress two times in my life yeah it's so cheap though I get an ounce for you call $40. It stress? $40. It's called stress because it gave you stress. It does. It stressed me the fuck out. Schnickel fit. It never stress. calmed me down. I, I call weed. Yeah, dude. You call it what it no, is. That shit. Mm-mm, I didn't Pencil get savings. You mean turd shaving? <laughs> <laughs> Look like, you know, like dead bird wings, just crisp. I don't even know what that meant, but like that was a just, Do you know what I mean? You made me hungry. Yeah, I, I didn't even mean. know Are what that Are you vegetarian? Meant. No. You eat chicken wings? Mm-hmm. Nice. I got some at the store. At the st- <laughs> I got some later at Ralph's when I go pick it up. <laughs> Get them frozen suckers. Remember Lady D always eating that whole bag of hot wings on her lunch break at Trader's? Mm-hmm. Did you guys work at Trader Joe's together? Yeah. Holy hell. Yeah, for like eight years. Ain't that some shit. Do you, you, don't, you don't work there anymore either. Right? I still do. You still do? Yeah. That's he dope. quit. How long have you worked there then? Uh, 12 years. You beat me now. You finally beat me. I had, I did 11. You did 11 years? Yeah. I heard it's a good place to work. Mm-hmm. It is. It is. It actually is. And you got fired, right? <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, it's got mm-hmm. fired. That's mm-hmm. all right. There's it's no a good shame day. in that firing that game. That was the best day of my life. Thank you, Wait, Joel. but it's a fam- It's like a famous story, right? Yeah, I farted on my manager, and <laughs> um, I've got... That's right. That's but right. Uh, it... I say, like, I do, I have a stand-up version of yeah. it, and then the, the real story, what happened, it's all true, though. Like, yeah. what had happened was that my antics were- There's always a stand-up version and yeah, yeah, version, yeah. Like, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is, because, you know, you can't, you got to punch up the jokes. I and, feel that. Um, I was just being a wild jackass at work and mm-hmm. filming it all of the time, mm-hmm. and it caught steam on the internet. It started steam. go- Steam. <laughs> it started go a little viral, and then yeah. some fucker ratted me out- wasn't it in Spokane or some shit? It was somewhere in Washington. Yeah, it was somebody in Washington showed their like they their showed, captain. Yeah, they. I don't even know. There's a it, captain. It was a. It was. <laughs> There's was, like, like a boat captain. The yeah. store manager is called the captain. Is it because it's 
fucking made of wood. Themed. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Do you guys report into like a tiki? A tiki fucking voodoo yeah. stand? God yeah. damn, you guys. I didn't realize. I'm sorry. Dude. It's okay. No, that was <laughs> hilarious. You guys get lazy. Fucking cat. For your first 30 days. We do, actually. Remember? You the, get a lay. We get the uh, helm speeds. I remember. Is that still a thing? Not anymore. Yeah. They change dude, all the listen, good things. I, I want to I I hear the end of it. What? I want to hear the end of it, but it does. I worked at Starbucks. <laughs> Did you have they, a captain? This is how they rope you in to fucking stay. No, they call it each other members. <laughs> oh, what's your yeah. member? Like when you go to buy like a coffee drink, like as an employee, <laughs> like what's your member? Like you belong to like. <laughs> yeah, I ain't a member. To the to the stock and star, yeah. which is all bullshit. But so it's just funny that <laughs> I didn't realize. <laughs> of course, Trader Joe's has a captain. And the first mate. Do you guys call each other mates? Yes. Yes, they <laughs> do. What's your actually. mate number? He's a to mate. You're a mate, right? No, I'm a merchant. Merchant. Um, oh, um, I was an export import. I just used to steal the vitamins because they're expensive. That's but, hilarious. And I had no soul then. I I'd just... want to be like a sailor. <laughs> Give me like that a, 5 a HTP. Viking. I need it for my depression. <laughs> I'd make you all call me One Eye Willie. <laughs> <laughs> From the Goonies. That's, I'd be like, no, nope, my name is One Eye Willie. I put it on my name tag. Hey, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> That's me all the time. Holy shit. Junk? I'm getting that tattoo when I, I leave here. That's, I love the Goonies. You have no idea. I quote that till the cows come home. So anyway, so you, so you farted. Remember when he said, ah, ah, Chunk's getting kidnapped and he's going, and then he's in the back. If you look in the back, zoomed in, they're they're showing the guy singing. He's going. Vim, vom, ba, rim, va, hai, that sounded racist. I met him, and by the way. You did in real life. My homie did too. In real life. But did you ever see Chunk in the background just going like this? <laughs> I used to rewind it on that. It's a little hidden gem. I you met him? It, yeah. Is he a dick or is he nice? Was that he seems one of very my nice. Four hundred jobs. No, he was no. I worked at a bakery at Sweet Lady Jane Bakery. Over I love on Sweet Melrose. Lady Jane. Yeah, I used yeah, to yeah. work there. A lot of celebrities would come in there. I'd have a Mexican wedding cookie from there. It was a little dry. It was a little dry. <laughs> My aunt makes them better. <laughs> well, I mean. Thank you, Norma. Yeah, now that makes sense. Thank you, Aunt Norma. Aunt Norma makes the best sweets. That she makes me up. this chocolate peanut butter cake that's to die for. And one time she forgot the peanut butter frosting, and I hate it. <laughs> 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 she makes me the best desserts ever. And uh, she she makes whips up this, this peanut butter frosting. Uh -huh. That's like... I can't explain it other than it's just heaven. I would give up my tranquil minds for this peanut butter <laughs> frosting. It's the be and then she makes the best right chocolate chip cookies with walnuts. Yeah. Some of you chocolate chip purists don't like nuts in your cookies. You fuck off. It adds to it. It adds to why am I just talking like this? <laughs> what were you saying? There's some ADD Go conversation back. shit that we got. I don't even know where we where started. We start? I've tabbed it a little bit in my head. Eventually, no, eventually home base. Home base is, I want to finish the story of your Trader Joe's But fart. you met Vimo. But, but we, Vimo. But we met Vila Solano. I we'll, met him. We'll have to add that in so they know. Fair use act, seven seconds. This guy sings. <laughs> it's in Italian or Spanish it's in it's or Italian. I think it's Italian. He's a Pavarotti. Yeah, dude. Tenor. I meant to say tenor, but I said the, the fat man. Yeah. <laughs> Can you say that anymore? <laughs> yeah. He's doing well. Yeah, yeah. They're yeah. all doing all yeah, right. Yeah, he's got yeah. chicken wings. Yeah. So anyway, that's it. I mean, there's nothing that that was the, the that was the peak of the story is that I I rang him up. A sweet he, lady, James. Yeah, he said you're very pretty. I, I rang said, up a ton you. of celebrities at TJ's. I rang up uh, Jesse Jess from from Say by the Bell. Mm -hmm. Jess, she was hot as shit, and her kid was bad, man. That kid was <laughs> fuck. He was. I mean, he was just a toddler. He was, just, you know, he. I, I say he's bad. He uh, he couldn't have been no worse than me as a child. He's just grabbing all the candy. You know, one of those <laughs> kids. Those guys. They're so funny. You're like, oh, this kid. Good luck, lady. <laughs> you gotta. You gotta. You gotta kid with energy gusto. gusto jesse was there's not enough time right who's jesse from saved by the bell didn't you just say oh jesse yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> this too much this too much you can't no that ain't that's that. too much you that, forgot no. what you just said so did you where did <laughs> no, we start no we started i at, got tabs <laughs> Jesse Spadness Fino. Jesse is the curly haired one that yeah, did yeah. the stripper foot, the stripper movie. And I gave her a chocolate. 
You gave, you gave her I just gave her chocolate. I said, you're fucking because of famous her and hot and I grew up on you. And then she was just funny because she, she was talking about, I forgot, like the power of women on how she just gets free shit because we laughed about it. And I was like, I don't know why I just gave you that. She's like, oh, it happens all the time. <laughs> Isn't that funny? That's funny. Now, I could wait in my head. I'm like, I never got, I don't get free shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like trying to think about the free shit I got. Nope. <laughs> Yeah, you did. No, you got free so. chicken wings. At Ralph's that we have to go pick up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got cool, you. Cool, cool. No. See. Case closed. Trader Joe's. Thanks, man. <laughs> Brought it all back home. You're right. Trader Joe's. So you got fired for getting free yeah, farted who, on somebody. Who, who, you know, who ratted me out? Was it a customer? I know a customer brought it to the captain, right? All or I was know it a, was the I captain was like, brought it to the main office yeah that's all i know i don't know how they found out you're, but it was you're right Re- regardless whoever initially ratted me out the captain mm-hmm. he didn't have to do what he had to do but thank <laughs> you but thank you you being a rat little bitch was the best thing that ever happened to my life mm-hmm. isn't that crazy? That is crazy sometimes rats will set you free but don't be snitching it's <laughs> bad it's bad so that was it he snitched you out he snitched me out and then my manager pulled me outside and i've told this story before it was this funny because he was my friend like uh-huh. he went to my show the, man, the manager my 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 store your, not your, not the rat in washington yeah was, my cat was your compadre because he went to my show saturday which was like the second or third one he's been to and he's been since and he's the best and and he's like you know he's like He's almost crying. I'm almost crying. He's like, I gotta fire you. I was like, I know, man. Oh, it's like dude. it's not. It wasn't him. Mm-hmm. I was like, I get it, bro. You got a, you got a good paying job. You get rid of me. Yeah. It what is he gonna like stand that? his ground? No. <laughs> it's me or him. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, fire me, bro. It's okay. And that was it. Yeah, that was it. And then I, I was, of course, lived in crippling, crippling anxiety of whether I was gonna make it financially or not through stand up. And then it all worked out. And now I headline in slang hoodies. In slang hoodies. <laughs> and stickers. Oh, I got new stickers. Where did we put? Are they some close by? And right here on the desk. Oh, no, I got them. Got Lucy Goosey stickers? Came in. I got my little Lucy Goosey stickers. Those are dope. These are so cute. Those are dope. For your skateboard, your surfboard, or slap them on your teacher's booty when she's not looking. <laughs> Those are good, Craig. Very nice. That's very good. <laughs> you, yeah, you were just in my hometown. Louisville. Yes, you were. Why yes, didn't you, you tell were. me? I would have had you do the th- show. I wasn't there. Oh. I saw that you. I saw that you were there. But I've never I've, that new. The place that you performed at is new. It's Brand, like a, it's like yeah. a VHS. It's the VHS. It's tapes. cool. It's like a tape store. Yeah, but it's really a venue, so that's where it's misleading. But yeah. it's super cool. So it's it's so cool. It's they say it's a like video rental store. It is, yeah. But it is, but it's more a bar and a venue to do <laughs> yeah. shows. It's yeah. like ten percent. Yeah, you can rent a DVD, but they they a DVD, <laughs> a DVD, a VHS. <laughs> Ain't that some shit? I feel like people buy those things just to put them in a frame on their wall. Now you can't actually. I have DVDs. I don't. Do you play DVDs? No. See, you know, it's like buying an old car. You have to find the part or it don't run. But nobody has nobody makes a part anymore. I know. Did it's... you do community service, by the way? I was trying to figure out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the name of the whole part. I did community service, court ordered a <laughs> few too. times. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it was... <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was like, because I watched the beginning of the podcast. Is you know you at a beach cleaning shit up for, and so I was like, oh shit, I guess I, he's. Did you done. have to do that too? I didn't live on a beach, dude. I you live. I got it all in Kentucky. I've I've done community service three times for yeah. three different things, but it was all in Kentucky. We would have had to clean a beach. You did freeways. The freeways. I didn't even do freeways. No, it it's. I was trying. Honest to God, I was trying to think because the your podcast, the name of it, I was like, fuck, I've done community service, which made me start thinking. I was like, what, what did I, what did I even do? Yeah, what'd you do? Because for one of them, it was for a DUI. I actually got arrested for a DUI. That's okay. That's good. Yeah, that's cool. It's cool. It changes you. <laughs> it's cool. Did it though? <laughs> no, it did. It did. I got. I went in. Yeah, it I woke I, you up a little bit, right? 
I mean, I didn't, yeah, I didn't stop anything, but like, <laughs> yeah. but I was in the hole because it was during Derby. I got arrested. So Home I hit Derby? it. Roller what? Derby? No, dude. The What's K- Derby? Kentucky Derby. That's what I said. Dude, <laughs> that's not a roller derby. It has horses. <laughs> the difference the between derby? the East Coast, West Coast. No, the My horse... dad loves the ponies. You know what? Yeah. No, I'm serious. He literally has a frame of fucking Cory Nakatana on his wall. It's a jockey. Like like a Seattle slew, the cigar. He likes horses. I swear. He's got frames of horses on his wall. <laughs> Framed. Framed horses. He had framed horses on his wall before his family. We're up there now, but the horses were first. Yeah, people he love loves that shit. the ponies. They love it. It's he like... used to record them on VHS as a kid. I swear to God, full circle. He'd pop in and uh, he'd I program it and record, and he and we and then he we he'd come home and watch his little ponies on VHS. That's awesome. And away they go. Can't the song about the you know. away they go. Kari Nakatana. I just remember that guy won a lot. <laughs> Kento the Sormo. They always had weird names to the jockeys. Yeah. Kento Secundo. They all sound alike <laughs> when you do that. Pat Day was the one that I remember. He Pat was, Day Pat, Pat, Pat takes Day. the lead with Seattle Slow. <laughs> what was that That's last one called? Good. Sebastian Prefontaine? Sebastian Bach. <laughs> no. He was a great jockey. Seabiscuit. Seabiscuit. Sea there you go. Sebastian Bach. Sebastian Bach. <laughs> that guy is the biggest brat baby I've ever seen in my life. I watched the documentary, not documentary, reality TV show right. where they were trying to create a super group. It had Jason Bonham, <sighs> no. John Bonham's son, Sebastian Bach. It had, uh, I don't remember his name, but it was Tara Patrick's husband. She's a porn star that I grew up with. and uh, But her man's a, a, a rocker. Yeah. So it was like four old school rockers making a super group yeah. and he would throw like tantrums because he didn't get his jog in sebastian he Bach. Could, yeah he couldn't do an interview with the lady there to interview him even though it was scheduled a week ago he's like i didn't run yet she has to wait and i was like oh you're a brat piece of shit do the fucking interview and then run. if you lose a day running i'm a runner <laughs> like physically running yeah he was complaining uh. that the lady there to interview him like in, in, well, even though it was scheduled, he had an appointment. You know, like okay, okay, you're on VH1 Classic trying to make a super group <laughs> with fools that their bands fell apart. Do the fucking interview, Bach. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, well, I don't like a guy with a bad attitude. He does. I don't like bad attitude. Yeah, it's like get over yourself. You're a millionaire. You're yeah. a millionaire, bro. He does cameos if anyone. <laughs> well, if he's if he's doing cameos, maybe he's not a millionaire. Anyway. <laughs> so, I mean, not yeah. I don't know how well things are going or not yeah. going. You know what I mean? Just hopefully they use his songs in a movie and he gets some residuals. <laughs> They're they still tour. Oh, he's got he's got money then. You know what I'm saying? He's slanging hoodies. He's all right. Hoodies, but they just huh? looked at hoodies and stickers <laughs> and stickers. <laughs> 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 I never had the balls to put anything on my teacher's ass. I went to an all girl Catholic high school. I did a lot of other things, but I would never. <laughs> I didn't. I yeah, didn't, it, I didn't. I don't think I really did that. I did some bad things. I put that, <laughs> that push pin one time. I don't want to talk about that. <gasps> a push pin? Yeah, but her ass was so thick it didn't <laughs> penetrate or something. For real, for I, real. That's where I got you sat on that shit. I put you would have got fired if I that know. was. If you could have gotten fired from high school. Suspended, expelled. Fired. Did you get suspended? It was a different time. No, I'm serious. She sat on it and she didn't feel it. And then you put a push pin on a up teacher's stool. On her stool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then it didn't work. And then I panicked and I was like, <gasps> I have made a big mistake. What was I thinking? You don't think things through when you're 15, 14. You're just a dumb fuck. So dumb. And then I was trying to get rid of it and I was so scared. I was like, I, I think I paid a buddy or some shit. I was like, hey, go get that out of there. Please get it out. I can't get caught. She hates me. <laughs> she hates me already. She hated me. She was mean to me. She started it. I started it. I was a bad kid. I was bad. I was on the sugar. I was on the sugar. You're on the sugar. I and mean, it just leads to drugs. <laughs> Nobody tells you that. So, but that's how. So, what did you do community service for? What did you get in trouble for? I don't really remember. There's too Damn, many. Dude. Um, that. Oh, one of them was the I threw uh, firecrackers at police on horses. <laughs> that was what? one of them. But that was I had community service like three or four times too. 
I think just tickets, suspended license, yeah. shit like that. Not basically taking care of myself. Yeah. <laughs> so you had to clean up trash on beaches. Yeah. Yeah. And that's not bad, dude. And, I no, mean... that was that was not that bad. But what I didn't know is the beach cleanup is obviously 50 million times more beautiful than the freeway for sure but it's it's kind of more safer. laborious it's more because you have to walk through sand you're walking through sand for eight hours and you're literally pitchforking up bundles of seaweed and it, that is so heavy that is so you know you're getting rid of seaweed on the on the beach mm -hmm. but you're you basically every night my head lower back pains you're just like ah ah and then you're doing toilet <laughs> toilet you're cleaning the toilets and seaweed <laughs> and sweeping the sidewalks it sucks seaweed. it sucks i mean a nice view but and also i'm born and raised in this area yeah so by everyone kept going by me on bikes hey craig hey what'd you do <laughs> i don't want to talk about it hang yeah. on I gotta... i'm sweating they're having fun that's and the I'm problem just... with getting arrested in your hometown dude it's always in front of somebody yeah. that you know you're like see what happened to craig me. yeah we all did yeah, shame. I oh. got I got arrested in front of my ex boy or yeah, my ex boyfriend at the time, his name was Cookie. Right out in front of Taco Bell. Uh, and fuck. <laughs> cookie. All of them. I was like, God damn it. God damn it. God damn it, Cookie, look away. One hundred percent. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. Well the, I, yeah, there's a yeah, differences between East Coast community service and West Coast community service. Yeah, either way it's labor. Either way. Either way it's hard labor. Because on the Lights. freeway, you get the little tongs. You just pick up litter. I mean, you that's do. awful for sure. <clears throat> but it's a lot easier than giant seaweed. fucking pitchforks of seaweed. It's all wet and heavy. It's not dried up. You think we're getting the dried up? No, the tractor gets the dried up stuff. We get the wet stuff. Oh, <laughs> oh. Just picture like a sea urgent, like <laughs> Ursula doing community service <laughs> from Little Mermaid. That was a stretch, but <laughs> I found a way to piece it together. Yeah. Sorry about that. No, Waterloo right. break. Cookie. Oh, yeah, that's right. You got arrested. <laughs> Waterloo break. <laughs> you got arrested in front of a lover. I got arrested I in front of these girls' house, my buddy, when the, the he stole the neighbor's car on accident. Remember that one? And then I smuggled Oxycontin into jail. <laughs> I've told that story a bunch, but it's you a smuggled good one. Oxycontin. In, ooh, have y'all watched that new, the new Netflix? on accident? I mean, they were chasing me, the cops, and I just put my drugs in my nuts because no? yeah, I didn't yeah. want to get a <laughs> possession of narcotic charge. <laughs> but they found it. No, and then I just went to jail with it in my in my, in they my didn't, boxer briefs. They didn't strip search you before you I went. I put in? it under the flap of my nuts. They don't search that good. <laughs> and then uh, that's some big old nuts. <laughs> and that was a, no, or a very small, a very small bag, or just one pill. Yeah. It's like the whole bottle's under your nut. <laughs> yeah, no, it's a little baggy, a little baggy of pills in a bottle. You're like, it's, it's I put just this whole bottle. <laughs> <laughs> it's it a bag, sir. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. And then, uh, so I got arrested in front of this girl's house, and then we're getting, you know, arresting. And they mm -hmm. got lights and sirens, and we're drunk. I'm yelling at my buddy. The Fuck you, fucking Steven. I'm never hanging out with you again. You're going to be arrested, Steve. fucking Steven. And then the, the the whole house party comes out, and we're getting arrested in <laughs> front parties. of the house party. <laughs> and it was like a, it was like hot girls and shit. And I was just like, I'm sorry, Juliana. <laughs> I didn't mean to. <laughs> I'm fucking crying, getting locked up. I was like, and there was these other, I was talking to one girl there, and, and I was just like, you know, like, no booty tonight. I'm going to jail. Well, not that house kind. parties. Not that not kind. That kind. I, well, I'm at just least <laughs> at least I'm not the top anymore. <laughs> yeah. Just depends on what you know, top or bottom. What kind of booty? We getting about. we getting bottomed in prison, baby. How I long know. were you there for? Oh no, I get bailed out. Just that one was just a drunk tank, no charges. Yeah, drunk mm. tanks are the worst. Those They're the bad. best though, because Those there's no charges. There's no charges. Well, I, I mean, say what you want to say about the drunk <laughs> thing. There's no charges in the morning. But probably dudes, when you're throwing girls talk, if you're, because I was obviously all women, and so we all talk. And then I'm sure guys, I don't know if you all go in there if everybody talks. Everybody's fucked up. You know what I mean? I was held in like I don't think it was a drunk tank, but it was like a like a holding cell. Yeah. You know. I just went. I just went to sleep. Yeah, nobody, nobody's sleeping. We're all jibber jabbering. What'd you I do? Sleep? What'd you do? Are you fucked up? Where are you from? Yeah. Oh man, 
when those jail when they I know I haven't been like locked up, locked up, but you know when you when they clank it, they clank the. It's a bad feeling. You go, oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. It's a bad well, I'm feeling. in here, aren't I? <laughs> it's a bad feeling. It's a really. Bad it's a feeling. really bad. Your soul, a little chunk, your soul <clears throat> dies, and you're just like, uh, yeah, you know. Yeah. You're like, hope I get out. I hope I don't get bottomed. I was in there long enough. I was there 36 hours about. And I was there long enough to make, I was, I was a food bitch. I was somebody's food bitch. Like, yeah. they would take my food. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I would give it. Yeah. <laughs> in 36 I, I hours? Happy. Yeah. That's Cause all Because that was, I was saying, it was derby time. So a lot of people are locked up. Ah, oh, gotcha. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's, yeah. Like a, it's like prime time. Your drunk tank was 36 hours? They don't, they let you out. And they, That's the thing. I don't think it was a drunk tank. That's what I charge. say. Like, I don't think it was. You a, got I got a charge you for got, sure. You did something. But I didn't. I hit a, well, I hit a car, first off, right in front of a cop car. <laughs> yeah. With a car? Second off. Yeah. 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 Should've I was been trying park, to parallel park, park there. <laughs> That's what I mean. That's what I, I was trying to parallel park. You know, okay, so where you performed is called Barstown Road, right? Mm. And it's like the main strip in Louisville. There's only one, and it's Barstown Road. And it's the busiest. It's like Mardi Gras. You know what I'm saying? During derby time, everybody's there. The bars are closed for two hours, so it's packed. So my drunk Closed ass, for two hours or open? The, the bars are closed for, for two hours. Only two hours. Only two hours. Gotcha. And then they open back up again. Damn. So it's packed. And so you can't find a parking spot. So I was shit faced. Yeah. Shit faced. And so I found a spot that I thought I could fit in to oh, parallel no. park. And oh, it was bumper no. to bumper. So there's there. And so you think you're caught. I you just think you're invisible. I don't know. I'm like, I'm going to park there because you're just going to. Yeah. And like there, a moped couldn't have fit in that fucking spot. But I was like, I'm going to fit it. Yeah. So I put it in reverse. I didn't even try it. <laughs> <laughs> to do that i just whoosh, whoosh, slammed back hit the car there was a cop car behind that car and then it hit that i car. didn't even make it to the spot i got and then whoosh, 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 whoosh. Oh. what an asshole and you then know, I was protect and serve huh so <laughs> looks like harassment to me <laughs> it totally was harassment it was terrible I, yeah I, they made me do the they had to walk the line I had flip flop. I couldn't do it, and so I had flip flops on. Yeah. I was like, "Dude, I think it's because I have flip flops. Can I take my flip flops off and do it again?" <laughs> and then they let you. Yeah, I, I like flicked it. I'll never. I, I didn't like bend down and take it off like a proper. Did it hit the person. cop and you got a salt? It came like to his face because I flicked it, and then I continued to do it. <laughs> I think that I feel like they're fucking with me because I already blew like I already blew yeah, over they just, and they just did it anyway they're like oh Dicks. this is gonna be fun it was so terrible this is going viral <laughs> that was prehistoric I think long before any of that stuff but that... you uh, made me remember the time I paralleled park high on Molly and fucking god knows what else I was twacked out I was at this party I thought I could spend the night, and then I guess I couldn't. And then I was parked in the driveway, and I was blocking everybody in. And mm -hmm. I, I almost just said, oh, fuck it. I'll leave my car in. Mm -hmm. But then I was like, no, that's fucked up. I better drive home. <laughs> that's fucked up, too. I'm not proud. Don't drink and drive. But this was this was what you did back then. There was no Uber. This was 1944. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Back in the 60s. Back in the day. And then I drove and I was searching for a parking spot, searching, searching, searching. It was like a holiday. It was, it was by the beach. It was in this area. It's yeah. like 4th of July or Memorial. There's no parking here. And finally, I think I found one. I was like, oh, and I parked. I parked perfect. I did. I remember thinking like, damn, I did it. I did it. You know, I didn't hit shit. And then I go crash at a homie's house. I eat all their Chinese food. I feel bad. I'm like, I'm sorry, ladies. Yeah, yeah. And, uh. They're dear friends of mine. Thank you. And then they, uh, I, I wake up in the morning and I just seen this. I'm looking for my car. I'm looking. I'm looking. And there's some guy on his like balcony or window. He goes, hey. And I, and I was like, yeah. And he's like, you looking for a white Ford Ranger? I was like, yeah. He goes, you're an asshole. And I had parallel parked in front of a driveway to like a 40 unit apartment sure complex. Did. Yeah. And I blocked all of them in mm -hmm. and they couldn't leave. 
and then I got towed, and I, it was like a three hundred dollar mistake, and I ruined a lot of people's day, and got called an asshole by a stranger from a window because he knew. I was just like, "What the fuck?" I was like, "I could have sworn it was right here. I know it was fucked up, <laughs> I, but it was it was in this area. There's mm-hmm. no white pickup truck." That sounds about right. Yeah. Sounds appropriate. Molly. I never did Molly. Yeah, it's a good one. It gets these kids. Be careful. You're going to drain all your serotonin. And then you're going to be hunting for these later in life. <laughs> hunting. <laughs> hunting in the great in the great aisles of Whole Foods. Whole Foods. <laughs> Got that you ash fucker in the room, motherfucker. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Well, I'm glad you made it out okay, buddy. I did. We'll see. <laughs> no, we're doing good. Better than I've ever been doing in my life before. And it's still hard. <laughs> mm-hmm. Isn't that crazy? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but do you mm-hmm. talk about all that in your stand-up, too? Mm-hmm. I don't think I've ever seen a full stand-up set of yours. You Just the, uh, the Bonaventure. Do it right now, Craig. No. <laughs> <laughs> That what that you During were at the stand up show. The woman show, right? The woman show. That was like fifteen hundred women. Which one are you talking about? The one where I met oh, you. Oh shit! At the Bon Adventure. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was. It was a women's conference. It was a women's world conference. World conference. Isn't that right? I was so nervous. It, at the hotel. There was like three dudes there. I swear <laughs> to fucking yeah, God. Yeah, yeah. And they were all servers. Uh, it was women. It was women. Wait, though. Wait, but that was at the hotel. Yeah, yeah. Bonaventure in downtown LA. I remember that. That dude. shit was lit. That was hilarious. Yeah. I pull out all my best period jokes. Though. Yeah. It killed. Yeah. It killed. I did my best. I'm just. <laughs> period jokes. <laughs> I didn't well, even have any period jokes. I just talked about bleeding. And, yeah, that was awesome. I just talked about my mama's big that. booty. They loved and it. it. Killed. Yeah, they all had big booties. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. That's hilarious. That was awesome. There was three dudes. I felt for them, too. I was like, <laughs> fuck, man. You're me all right. Well, also, too, on top of that, because it was also like a sober, it was like 1,500 sober 1,500 women. 1,500 sober women. women. <laughs> and then a couple of, I don't know if you were like sober, sober at the time. At that time, I was 100. Was, yeah, yeah, a couple dudes weren't. And I was like, Dude, like <laughs> there are some, a lot of times people feel for me in particular shows or for, you know what I mean? For like, you're like, oh, this is going to be a tough show. But that was the one that I was like, I feel comfortable. But then when I saw dudes who were like not sober dudes, I was like, yeah, <laughs> I was so nervous. But do the, your I, best mom. Thank material, God. Dude. I That's what I did. I was like, thank yeah. God I'm sober because I have that connection. Yeah, and yeah. then talk about your mama. And that's it. Yeah. You <laughs> love like, these girdle jokes. <laughs> Bring out your best spank shit. Yeah, They're going to yeah. love it. <laughs> yeah. They're going to love it. And they did. That shit was awesome. I had an absolute blast. It was fun. Because there was also, not on top of that, but it was crazy. There was like two huge monitors. Oh, yeah. You remember yeah. that? Yeah. Of course. I'm God, easily that distracted. Was cool. I was like, look at myself. And a nice <laughs> carpet. Tammy, and a very nice, Tammy yeah. Joe Darren gave me that carpet. Afterwards. She did? Yeah. Why? Because I said, this is a nice carpet. And it she, was like cause a she, she was, uh, she put on the event, I mean, the, the show mm-hmm. aspect of it. Yeah. She's always doing shit. She's badass. She's great. Badass woman. Yeah. And she, like, made the stage and set it up and bought a carpet so it's just not, okay. like, a shitty, like, because, you know, it was one of those put-together stage. And uh, nice I was like, damn, that carpet's nice. And she's yeah. like, you want it? And I was like, oh, no, how big is it? Because it might have been bigger than my damn studio, you know? And it fit perfect. It covered the whole floor of my studio pretty much. Like 80% of my studio, that carpet she gave me covered. See? Tied the place together. <laughs> really about... brought the living room into the bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's up. It's not just about monetary payment, but kind of the exchange. Like yeah. pilgrims and Indians. And I gave it. To, oh, the yeah. Except, except we murdered all of them. I, not like that. I just meant corn. Yeah. <laughs> I, just on a lighter note. Just like food. Death. You know what I mean? I know. I know. I realize that. As soon as I said it, I was it's, like, it's, that is loaded. I didn't mean it like that. Kinda. I just meant like dried corn and squash. Oh. And <laughs> so the rug was trying. Wow. That I went. Love- <laughs> That I went a, incredibly wrong. I, I love a good kombucha okay, squash. Okay, I'm glad you got a rug. Why is it called kombucha? Stupid. Kombucha. 
Why is it called Ashkawanda? Ashkawanda. <laughs> My interpretation of Ashkawanda is is this is what I think Ashkawanda ha, ha, ha. is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna invent a pill. It's just called. What? <laughs> <laughs> what to do? <laughs> I used to always I just got light Remember that when you were a kid? What'd you say? I just, <gasps> you used to talk inwards when you were kid. <laughs> <laughs> I never forget. It's that feeling I, I, when I. Have you ever gotten the breath knocked out of you? Oh, yeah. You remember the first time that happened? Oh, it's. it's I it's, thought it's, I was going to so die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll never forget that first time. I was skiing. Whoosh, 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 no poles. And I took off. <laughs> and then, like, I hit this big jump. And I'm like four foot nothing i was tiny but like i was like oh, and I came, <laughs> oh. came right down on my back i was like cuckoo oh. and like i couldn't breathe yeah. like yeah like that there's a lot of sound effects on this i apologize <laughs> is this just audio yo I, it's a lot of that. asmr getting the breath knocked out of you is the, it's it's the horrible. worst it's the worst I thought somebody stole my skeleton <laughs> out of my throat. The, I think the worst time I ever got the wind knocked out of me, I was on a jumper way too old for for sure, like 18. No one's in there, me. It was one of our, our birthday parties, you know. And then I, I go, I jump and jump and then I go to dive out mm -hmm. of the hole mm -hmm. thinking I'd hit the little footrest and like bounce out like Batman or whatever. Instead, I just missed the inflatable footstep or whatever I thought it was and just dive out and hit the ground. Yeah. Like like jumping, jumping, like trying to be cool and just hit. And then I was just like, and I thought I, thought I was going to die. I was like, and I was soul. just in my head like, you did this. You did all of this. Mm -hmm. You weren't, you know, it yeah. was a stupid thing to do. Yeah. And now you're going... <laughs> And you just think you're dying. That's you always get it, it, but it's just when it's happening, you're like, "I die now. I die now." This is it. This is it. It's been a good life. It's been a, it's been a bad life so far. I wish I had a throat to breathe. <laughs> 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 it really is the worst fucking feeling. <laughs> God, I haven't had that. Maybe. I think. Do you remember? that viral video the grape the grape stomping lady <laughs> that is oh i hope she's all right are you kidding that is my all-time <laughs> favorite oh, 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 it was oh, the... oh. Yeah, she got what she deserved though did you see it she tried to cheat she tried to cheat did you see that um, that's what she I... went like it, 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 she said okay stop it. and then she went <laughs> and then she did you see yeah, yeah. It's in that wild. That's the most popular. That's where guys got me hands down to this day. <laughs> Still, my most favorite. Because everybody says that. Bitch, you got what you deserve. You, you cheated. cheated. You cheated. You cheated. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Have you seen Couch Falls on Guy's Head? No. I'm upset. I go down. Talk about deep rabbit holes, dude. I could circle that drain for this people one. getting hurt and. Fuck it, gnarly! It's unbelievable how I got obsessed with y'all. Do watch this? It's like uh, over in Russia they have um, car cams. Like I get obsessed with watching car cam videos, like wrecks and like <laughs> in the snow. I love that shit. It's horrible. It's, Are we watching it, this right now? I think you have to because I want to. I don't have to. I get to. Ah uh, yeah. Uh, there's several of these videos that I go to. We've talked about them before, <laughs> but they just bring joy to the world. So who cares? There's the the <laughs> Great Lady Falls is ooh, all time, ooh, 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 and then there's the the <laughs> this one's fucked I up now. I want to do my cell phone ring. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. I'm getting a call. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. I can't breathe. There's nothing more satisfying than watching someone get instant <laughs> karma like that. You're like, fuck you. And the newscasters <laughs> commenting, they're like, oh, I hope she's okay, and they're just laughing. It's totally nonchalant. Oh my ooh, god, seems dude. like she got really hurt there Todd Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. did you guys there's another one there's right up there with it that um it's a news I want to see that video but there's one that's a news anchor that with the lizard uh, have the you bug guys fall, seen? flies in his mouth that's one the black dude god damn it yeah yeah dude, yeah this that shit, podunk bullshit oh, oh my god he's my out god. in the field yeah uh, the, there's this one. black dude in the yeah. I believe the south yes and then he sounds like this hi well, this is 
Todd with your morning weather. And then a bug flies in his mouth and he just turns hood. He's like, motherfucker. And he's the fun. He went from Troy L- McClure to Samuel L. Jackson so like that. What really happened on that Thursday here at Augusta High School that led to Chris Wood's death? The fuck is that? And it's the funniest shit I've ever seen yeah, in my life. It's so good. It's so dope. It's oh so my good. God. And the and the monkey with the shit on the grandma's nose that looks like Gonzo, <laughs> and they made it into shooting stars. <laughs> there is no. Have you seen that God, one? You can Yes. Okay. 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 All these. These are okay, legendary. Okay. Watch this one. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> so it's our first reaction video. Hang on. I gotta make sure it starts at the beginning. All right. Ready? One, yeah. two, three, go. What is? What's this one? Couch guys on false head. I said that. Are you gonna play this for people watching? Yeah, it's right here. <laughs> what the fuck they trying to? They're try- <laughs> it killed them. You see his toupee fly off? You see his wig fall? You see his He's hair like- fly off? His hair piece fell off. What were they thinking? Oh, what were no. they thinking? <laughs> My man. Let me just drop a building oh, on my cold. head. It's scary though when you see somebody's limb just go like. <laughs> yeah, but he, did you see him try to get <laughs> up just though? Just get at the stuck. End? Like, no, I know that's what's so. It's like sad, but Watch it's him. also like. <laughs> Look at his hair piece. Look at that. Where's his hair? Where's his hair? Watch him get up. Watch him get up. <laughs> see what I mean? He grabs his, his hair limb. piece. He's like, "Where's my hair? Where's my hair?" <laughs> <laughs> I can't handle it. Where's, where's my hair? The guy almost dies. He goes, where's my, the hair fuck is my hair piece? Where's my hair piece? I don't know why. That, that one's a bit brutal, I'll admit. It's no. That it's, one's a bit harsh. You're like, ooh. If he if he didn't make it, it would be harsh. Like it'd be like, oh, he got damn. up though. He got up, but and it's just. <laughs> I mean, I don't want anyone to get that. hurt, but when it's that obvious, you're like, dude. That's your fault. What are you doing? <laughs> well, if he didn't look for his hairpiece, it would have, went, wouldn't have been as crazy yeah. and epic as it was. The hairpiece check <laughs> is what makes me laugh and not go, oh, no. Because <laughs> it makes it then he's just like, he's I'm bald. Right. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. My neck's broke. I'm bald. He's bald as fuck. Oh, my God. I could do this all day long. It uh-huh. kills me. Nothing makes me laugh harder than this nonsense. Were you a, a, a girl up on America's Funniest Home Videos? I did. Oh, my God. The highlight I reel? Did. The highlight? Remember when they did all the falling? Yes. Oh, my God. Crushed. Gosh. <laughs> crushed and we've been so trying to, good we've, it crushed i wish i wish i i watched it religiously really and also too i don't know this bob might, saget bob saget but also the, there was like a blooper show too like i watched all of them yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i mean it's like way back when but i like, watched sports bloopers um they had that bloopers. and then they that and then just bloopers that uh don that hosts hosted uh, i mean that show hosted by don deloise what was that candon camera Remember oh that one? my god that was a good that's one. not cut it out i'm thinking cut it I'm out that's with joey from joey uh, from full Baton. house what's his real name Dave Coulier. Dave, Dave Coulier. Coulier. Cut we it out. We had the bun, the Jack Bunny. Remember it was Jack Rabbit? What America's that? funniest people. Yeah, that's yeah. what it was. It was a spin-off, uh, yeah. Daisy Fuentes. Yeah. Well, you remember that? Oh shit? yeah, Daisy Fuentes. She uh. She, oh my god. She was on my morning news and the radio. I believe she was on D's sleep. Rick D's in the morning. Daisy Fuentes still killing it. Is she? That's nice. I don't know. I was asking you. I hope so. I have no idea. That's the last time I saw Miss Daisy. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Was with Dave Coulier doing Cut It Out. Cut fucking. it out. <laughs> Cut it out. Hopefully oh, it's, yeah. it's on some sort of Russian Netflix. She's still getting residuals. <laughs> I hope so. I get residual checks every once in a while for two cents. Oh. I, two cents. When I did MTV's, uh, when I did uh, Punked, I'll still get So that's residuals. a union job. Yeah. I did MTV twice. They never sent me one residual it was check Astro in my life. or something at that time, though. Damn, damn well, non-union can, buyouts. I, I, I'll shoot you my five cent checks. I want two cents. You can. <laughs> I've gotten one cent. I've gotten one cent. That's just rude. Just wait till it accumulates to ten bucks. Mhm. <laughs> mhm. Just hold your horses. What'd you do on MTV? I did the greatest party story ever told, which that show never really seemed to pick up or take off because no one's ever heard of it. And then I. But did... was it picked up? I mean, it aired. I think once or twice. I I didn't. No one ever. I did this little 
interview on Ghost Hunters, Ghost Adventures. Oh, and I've that. gotten a, a hundred DMs saying, I saw you on Ghost Adventures. <laughs> I did MTV's Greatest Party Story Ever Told. I, I think I maybe got one. One. Like, they don't air it. They don't air it. The next episode, though, they aired that shit for like a decade. That was crazy. <laughs> My cousins in Mexico, like nine years later, were like, oh my God, Philip. That's my middle name. They call me <laughs> Felipe. And they're like, he's. And I was like, what? I was like, that was nine years, you know? Mm -hmm. Fucking wild. Mm -hmm. But it was non union, you know? So yeah. you get you get 100 bucks for the day. But was this. Was this and they get 100 show? million. Uh, I don't really actually, remember yeah. That show. Next or greatest party story ever told? No, I know next. Ne but the greatest party person. story ever told you just told the story where i told the story about smuggling fireworks across state lines for sure and then they animated it into a cartoon it was awesome i really wish they would have that's great yeah you tell a story and they make a cartoon out of it so it's so dope and funny and then it just never did it almost feels like they didn't even try they didn't even, i think i saw it on air one time I was like, this is your show, your station. You know, you could put it, put it on more. It would help me out a great deal. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, I've shot old, some stuff. That the I old one, got. two time Aaron. <laughs> but that was it. That's all you did for MTV. Yes. Okay. I don't have many credits. Most of mine are just stand up. Yes. But I got a lot of those. I stand up all over this country. Yeah. I know. You're traveling all the time. Yeah. It's you like crazy. it? Yeah. It's, uh, last time we talked, we talked. Remember, we did Tammy Jo Deeren's yeah at the Asphalt Comedy during the pandemic. Outside, everybody was in their cars with little clappers. Yeah, that was wild that and was hard. Crazy. That did was you so do hard. Zoom shows? Yeah. How was it? I did like two. I oh, was like, I, I, I can't do this. I did like a hundred of them, and I'm, I get sad when I think. About I get so it. sad. I it's can't so, have my sadness so on the hard. Zoom. I can't have my sadness. <laughs> I did, and then I would click end, and I go, <laughs> "What am I doing with my life?" And then shove a bottle of Tranquil down your throat because it's. Just I didn't too much. have those back then. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even have weed when I was doing those. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. I just had my dark thoughts and a studio apartment with no kitchen. Yeah, that's all right. Do you ever miss working at Trader Joseph? No. <laughs> not at all god no I sometimes i miss people for sure i love a lot of co-workers and we did have a good time but work is work i stock bananas and clean toilets i don't want to fucking do that ever again <laughs> yeah. i was good at produce though I what is with the, the produce shit out people, of that dude? Shit. Yeah, there is a produce whole underground community. I loved it, and it was just I would hate. I also like I wouldn't mind Trader Joe's if they would just be like Craig, go do produce, make it look beautiful, and then I just did that. But they don't do that. They're like Craig, clean the toilets, run register, hop on one foot, and do the produce. You're like that's not fucking possible, assholes. <laughs> it's one or the other. And they're like, oh, we got this other guy to do produce, and he just dumps the box out. Like, that's not doing produce, bitch. You see my apples? You see his apples. It's a, it's an art form. I love making I it look saying. pretty. I, I love, I truly did. It but, was fun. It was like a puzzle. I know. So you I know. like that aspect of it, but they would, you know, just understaffed, overworked, like every fucking corporation ever, even yeah. though they're slightly better than most because you get benefits and shit. They're still a corporation. And a good shirt. You get a good, you get a, get good, a good flower fit. shirt. You get a good fit. Yeah. No, that's all I was saying. Anytime you see produce, people, it's serious shit. It's yeah. like watching a muralist. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, dude. I got in. I got down. I got pictures. I know. I'll show you. We'll put them up. Remember when I yell at managers because they do a bad job? Mm -hmm. Like, hey, who fucked did my section? <laughs> I'd be yelling at them like, dude, you, just, you didn't even rotate. You put the old dates on top. I mean, bottom. You know what I meant? Yeah. Who's who? who but Who's, when but when you shop, do you always go for the back thing on the shelves oh, because I check you've dates. worked? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You check the dates. Same. I check always the check the dates. You old, especially at Trader Joe's. <laughs> especially at Trader especially Joe's. Especially on those fucking salads. I love Trader Joe's. I love you. You guys Very grabbing much. front row bread. Reach Who? to the back, you animals. <laughs> rookie. You won't want the, rookie shit the oldest there. bread. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. By that top frozen item that could have been sitting there for eight hours. Who knows? Freezers may have went down. Things happen. 
the top box That's defrosts then about. freezes back up you're welcome for all that little glacier ice on top because mm-hmm. you didn't dig under mm-hmm. you gotta get the meatballs from below that's what's up <laughs> you gotta get the turkey meatballs that's what's up that's what's up I, that, I feel like that's why I've worked 16,000 jobs so I have an appreciation yeah as in how to yeah. navigate and around I getting fired grocery stores <laughs> 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 I've been fired numerous times but yeah but that's once you know that you have that knowledge you always go for the back yeah I went in too high to Jamba Juice, Juice Stop, a Did juice you? smoothie shop I worked at in high school. I used to work there, and I went in too high, and he sent me home, and I just never went back and faced anything. That I happened. just said, well, there goes that job. I said, I have a tummy ache. <laughs> he said, what's wrong? You're high. I said, no, my tummy hurts. And then I left, and I never came back. I don't like to face anything. <laughs> I'd be running. Mm-hmm. Yeah, who wants to face that? confrontation Oof. who needs that job i'm going over to vince's spaghetti on hawthorne boulevard <laughs> i'm a bus boy now i made it <laughs> <laughs> what's the worst job you've had you take too many of those <laughs> no <laughs> they're not working i was sniffing the microphone i wasn't even tired <laughs> Actually, you do love sniffing that microphone. I sniff everything. I have a you problem. Do. Any new anything, Now I want to sniff it. Like, it smells clean. Yeah, I keep it clean. It smells fresh. I, uh, what'd you say? Worst job I ever had? Yeah. A loan officer slinging mortgages Dude. for American home loans. Boo. It's like the boiler room. It's like stress. Keep, keep calling. I already called them. Call them again. That's weird, man. That sucks. I've had a vehicle call. That sucks. I'm sorry. How'd you even get that job? Because there's an interview process, I would imagine. Hello, Craig. Thank you for applying <laughs> to selling mortgages and shit. Glad you're here. See, so you've worked at smoothie stores. What makes you interested I just, in selling mor- I was, mortgages? Did I get that correct? Is that what it was? All right. Yeah. <laughs> I was bad at it. I, I love was that really you got good. the job, though. Yeah. I actually was good at it. It was just too stressful, and I hated it, and it was like long hours and a long commute. But I got a lot of people. So I'm like, hey, hello, would you like to refinance your home? Okay, no, okay, no problem. They didn't like that. They didn't like that part. <laughs> that would be me but the people stuff. like that. You know, yeah. I wasn't a pesky fuck. But I they, don't know. They wanted you to be a pesky, annoying bastard, and that's why I hated it the most out of all the jobs. And I shoot my pants at it. <laughs> you shit your pants in shorts on casual job? Friday and black mud went down my calf and onto the carpet and I went and washed my ass sure thing sure that could leave a bad taste in your mouth I'm yeah. sorry to hear that Craig <laughs> yeah it's alright were you nervous is that cause your stomach had, no, it, it co- got you in the heebie jeebies it's cocaine and alcohol <laughs> that's yes that'll <laughs> yeah, do it that'll, that'll, do it. that'll cause involuntary explosive Woo! mud flows down your Woo-hoo! leg that makes sense that wasn't a fart I'm at work this is bad. <laughs> this is real bad. <laughs> I'm very sorry to hear that. My buddy ratted me out too. He emailed all. all Damn, the you got a lot of coworkers. rats in your life. Yeah, yeah. yeah he's yeah. like, Craig shit his pants. Look at his shorts. So I kept saying, Hey, let me get your truck. I gotta go to lunch. I gotta go to lunch early. I gotta go to lunch. <laughs> so I was gonna go buy shorts. You know. Mm-hmm. He's like, No, because he drove. We carpooled. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, Give me the car. Come on. He's like, No, it's my car. Like, let's just go at noon when we always go every fucking day. What are you doing? Mm-hmm. I was like, I shit my pants. I mm-hmm. need to go buy shorts. And then he laughed, and then he emailed all our friends, and then they made fun of me, and then I end up, well, everybody knows, I don't need to waste money on new shorts. And then I just rocked a skid mark the rest of the day, and I quit. A skid mark on your leg as well as No, no, I cleaned that up. I cleaned that up. (laughs) Because that shit will dry. I washed up. Like paint. Yeah, I Uh cleaned up. I threw the underwear away. Those were were done. Wore, put the shorts on, (laughs) free balling it, and kept my dignity. So you had shorts on the first time and it ran down your bare naked leg? Yeah, I wore shorts with boxers. I was, you know, I'm an old school. I oh, you didn't boxers. even have the whiteies I didn't, to cup no. it. Damn, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's like, that's, I'm sorry. Mud. That's like a free flow. Mud. Nope. That was, <laughs> yeah. I think I was on the phone too. I was like, excuse, <laughs> excuse, me, excuse me, lady. I gotta go. She's like, but I really I want for, this more. I forgot your name now. I gotta go. <laughs> it's Nancy. I gotta go, Nancy. I gotta go. <laughs> and I really want to purchase this second mortgage. There's a hot mug Craig. coming. But I really <laughs> click. click. I shit my pants, lady. 
<laughs> you don't want a loan from me. I shit my pants. I'd like a loan. Tell oh. me about it. Click. Click. Beep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry to hear about that. But it happened. I'm glad you cleaned up. It happened. Did I? In that, ha- but is that how you? In that your thing, like how you? In that, you, everybody tells a shit story. A poopies. Yeah, we're gonna get one out of you. I have to pee pee really bad though. Oh, oh yeah, nice. yeah, we're go. taking a long time. Perfect. Go if you need. Do you break to go pee? No, or you just do pee. it in your seat. You just go. Because <laughs> <laughs> whatever works, dude. I don't. Yeah, I go pee pee. Pee break. Time out. Are you? you? Really? <laughs> How are you? How are you, Craig? <laughs> How's it going? Did you? How was your? What's, how was your Thanksgiving with your family? They're all here, right? Yeah, I went to my sister's house. That was a good time. I was at the little kids' table where I belong. I don't want. I don't want to go no adult table. Talk about what? What did you do for work? Oh, fuck off! <laughs> I want to talk about butter and how delicious it is. Plato. Butter. Yeah. You probably to. get some good shit in your pants story out of the little kid table. They shit their pants all, all the time. They shit their pants at the table. <laughs> Isn't it great? <laughs> I was like, oh my God, this guy can't even Because the shit. Freedom. They're yeah. just free. Freedom to you sit have to in pee? his own yes. spicy. <laughs> yes. It's one of them's potty trained. One of them's not. Yeah. Isn't it crazy if you look like those little potty training thing, how tiny it is? You're like, I was, my butt was that small. <laughs> yeah. At when my knees were that low to the ground. Like, whoosh. Yeah, I'll, I'll go visit my nephew at his school and the toilets are like this high. <laughs> and you got those are the best. <laughs> and you're like, how, what? You forget, you know? They yeah, make those. They do. For schools, yeah. Yeah. They're like little village people. Yeah. It is like walking to like a little I mean, cobbler store. Who like, needs a squatty potty when you got that? You know? And all the, my, when they make the, what are they called? The stalls and like, and they're always so little. Oh, and yeah. Your yeah. head's like, <laughs> <laughs> and you can see the person that you're like, but you're full blown adult. You're like, fuck. Remember Uncle Buck when he went to pee at his, yeah. his nephew's school? It's a great movie. That's a great movie. Uncle's Molly Rolly was Horsel Swartz yet. Uncle Molly Russell's warts here, remember? The lady with the wart on her chin. And, and, and he Uncle flips Buck. her a quarter. Yeah. Damn it. He goes, Uncle Melanoma, Uncle <laughs> Molly Russell's warts here. And he goes, Oh. <laughs> I don't remember that one. It's I the remember best part. I know. Flicks, I remember Large Marge and Pee Wee. Tell him Large Marge sent you. Right? <laughs> I'm a rebel, Dottie. <laughs> that was the skit. That I'm was my rebel. first scary moment. When I was a kid, was Large Marge. I was like, bitch! Like, Jeez. and I had nightmares. Because you're a kid, you're watching Pee Wee Herman. I mean, the whole thing got tainted as, we all, went, <laughs> as we all moved on. But, like, but that's the first scary movie. God, that's a great movie. Great Pee Wee's big movie. But I don't remember the, the Molia Uncle Buck, even though I know the movie, but I can't remember. He flips a quarter at her and he's like, take, a, take the train downtown and get have a, a rat. rat. A nah, rat nod off. Now I remember. <laughs> Were you uh, Adventures in Babysitting? Fan? I was about ready to bring that up. You know why? Because that just made me think of the, the bl- blonde hair, short. Fuck the girl, the girl with the glasses. She had short blonde hair. She lost her glasses and she picked up a rat. Lady. She picked up a rat in the subway <laughs> and thought it was a bunny. Lady, that's not a cat. That's a jumbo size sewer, sewer rat. rat. <laughs> <laughs> best. Remember, best. she kept trying to write a check for a hot yeah. dog, and he goes, "You don't have any cash. I don't have a wiener." <laughs> I do remember that. Oh my god. What about Monster Squad? Wait you watch that one? Though. No, but wait. Hold on. Before you go on to your next thought, come back with me for one second. So, was Adventures in Babysitting, was that the one with Thor? Yeah. All right. Elizabeth Shue. Yeah. And Thor. Thor. And then he kissed me. And then with the, yeah, yeah, with the uh, drape. And <laughs> she did the whole wedding yeah. thing. Great movie. They don't make them like they that. They don't make anymore. them like that anymore. They don't, they make... don't dude. Too... What movie you talk about like that? these days none they're all woke woke woke. shit's ruining it (laughs) i'm all for equal rights but it's just like uh it's uh not trying to offend anyone and everyone in the writing process makes for stale shit you know yeah it's like god oh god god cusses too he just spit. You see that? God, no, I don't know. I, don't I know. thought he farted a little Hershey kiss. <laughs> it's the same <laughs> noise as as your lava lamp story down your leg. That's the bubble. The bubble. <laughs> the, yeah. 
the bubble fart. It's weird how they have so many different noises. Some are aggressive. Some are like razor blades and they hurt and you go, ow! <laughs> Some are like doors. <laughs> <laughs> All right, my all, all time fan, my brother, they were the air biscuiters. <sighs> <sighs> those are the good ones. Those, those are, the ones, are the good ones. Those are the ones you know. You know those stink. are the good ones. I don't know, dude. I don't know. I think those in my hot. family, it. I mean, somebody was talking about, I forgot, I think it was a comic. I don't even know where this came from. But it also, they were saying there how surprised they were to be awoke. To a fart sound is is a byproduct of air hitting your ass cheeks on the way out. That's what makes the the that's what makes that. Yeah. I never even thought about that. Yeah, because if you spread your, if dumb? you spread your cheeks, there's no noise. I know. And you just. Spread I've been them. on this world too long <laughs> that I didn't take the time to think about that i've been taking it for granted that that's just the sound that comes out your wahoo ho i just learned that you could wipe your ass sitting down i never understood it until i got made fun of for recently saying i you don't do it. that and then everyone and my friends made fun of me i also said it on chatty broads they have quite a big following <laughs> and then they're like what you don't know how to wipe sitting down and then i figured it out it's quite easy and i don't understand what took me so long <laughs> when did you learn that Maybe two, two three months ago. ago. Right. Seriously though, yeah. Because I would just stand up and squat and do it. Because I, I still do that sometimes because <laughs> you get in there better and you get it cleaner. Not but then I realized like, oh, you don't have to do that. I was like, oh. Now, when you say stand up, do you do this too? I found out uh, when I was like 27 that people sat to wipe i stood up my whole you life stood up as well but did you okay so okay. when you say i'm not the only one no. it no. took me about a decade <laughs> longer though <laughs> what did you I still you're wipe. a girl you know i wipe back to front that's to be legal you're not allowed to do that <laughs> <laughs> She's just, like, no shit. <laughs> i've been wiping back to front my entire life he must have a lot of infections. <laughs> <laughs> or a strong immune system. One or the other. <laughs> one or the other. We all learn when we learn. You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> infections. Just itchy. Anywho, so. <laughs> That's the worst. That itchy asshole is the worst. No, like, you go digging and then you can't even wipe your face off because you got sour fingers. No, you get pink eye. You get pink eye. You get pink eye. You get pink eye or sour either way that's crazy too bad. though i also learned that but why you get pink eye i learned that just a couple years ago shit fecal matter no i know now yeah. but i didn't know that i had these are the things you kind of have to sit and meditate on <laughs> inquire about be inquisitive think be curious pink eye is it only caused by fecal matter i don't know dude but i just know that's the top because i've had it a lot <laughs> <laughs> have you really Oh, let me like four times. You like stars, like a star Six on your times. Eyeball. No, just pink eye. It seals shut. Raw chicken. <laughs> oh, that's it, right. If you, yeah. Yeah, mine you. was definitely from shit then. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird. What's the same thing that's in fecal matter that's in raw chicken? Bacteria. That gets in your eyeball. E, dude. So when you would stand up and squat, would you stand up? <laughs> Move over, squat down next to the toilet. <laughs> in front or next and like get down and get in there and, like <laughs> squ and squat, squat. I mean, it work. it's effective. It's effective. Those are some good ass thighs. You've been doing that for a long <laughs> time, mean, dude. I got pretty legs. Damn. You can't tell. Shit. That's a lot of squatting. Woo. <laughs> That's crazy. No, I don't think there's any shame in just learning that you, <laughs> you can sit down. <laughs> I mean, I think. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of maneuvering, but I think for dudes, it's probably a bit different. Maybe. I mean, we still wipe the same asshole. <laughs> for sure, for sure. <laughs> but women, we've been just sitting. You just yeah, sit. You, I don't. I don't know. When they, I was in group chat with friends, and they were talking about group it, chat. and I felt dumb because I genuinely, I was like, oh, like, how, oh, how do you do that? <laughs> like, I don't want to ask though, you know, because they'd be like, what? I'm like. Oh, you just scoot forward and then wipe your ass on the seat. Um, <laughs> it's a, okay. Well, just leave you your just... skid mark on the top of the seat. No, scoot forward, not backwards. 
You go, you <laughs> scoot too far forward. If you're leaving skid marks on the front end, I might as well just stand up and squat then. This is the important stuff. We I'm glad we're here. having this conversation <laughs> at one o'clock on a Tuesday. On a Tuesday. I Tuesday. think this is the important stuff that people aren't talking about. Okay. If you ask my personal opinion. Are to. you looking at your list of questions? No. Oh, Sadie. Sadie. So it's one twenty one four. At one forty eight she'll be here. We so, so we're we, buying time. We got ten we just need like ten, fifteen. We can but fill we, that with plenty of feces. Oh, we got matter. shit. Plenty of feces. There's fecal matter everywhere. I, I saw a study once on uh people sitting versus standing and mm-hmm. it was like fifty fifty. Mm. Like there are a lot of people. Why who are they stand. making fun of me so much? I know. Fifty fifty. Who stand just to wipe yeah. their ass. Yep. But you can't just st- stand straight up like a pencil. No. Because then your no. ass closes yeah, shut no, like no. a book. Oh, you're squatting. And then you got to You're doing the squatty punch shovel. The toilet you're, paper you're, in there. You're doing the. Did you squat? So when you stood up, did you do the same maneuvering and squatting mechanism that. Not a full blown squat. Craig He's over too here tall. Did? Yeah. He's That's what I mean. Tall. You're a tall dude. Excuse me. Yeah, I don't. Good one. I think it's more effective to sit. It's definitely more effective because you're it. The toilet serves as a an aid, yeah, an assist, if you will. That automatically they were smart when they invented it because it takes your cheeks, <laughs> spreads them, <laughs> spreads them just enough, not just to do your business, but also to put paper in there. This has been a great talk, fellas, <laughs> and I really appreciate being a part of this. You know, some countries just have holes in the ground, and you just squat. yeah, dude. They don't even need squatty potties. Wait a minute, squatty potty? You don't have a squatty potty? potty? No, you, they got a little, the foot little foot step. You go like this. Those are dope. Those are so dope. <laughs> I got one. Once you start using that, you, you can't, can't go ever back. go back. I'll tell you. That's you, what happened to me. I didn't know, and now I know. Now you know. Squatty See, that's potty. what I mean. You know when you know, but sometimes it takes people a long time to know. What about ceiling hus? You know about that? Bitch, I learned about ceiling hus <laughs> like ten years ago. So what's up? Ceiling hose. That'll, that'll, that will Ooh. add three inches to your anal cavity. Yeah, that bitch. Will. That you know turd that's what it does. Out. Huge. <laughs> Was there a horse in my ass? Was there a horse in my ass? <laughs> you shit out a baby arm. Ow. I'm not kidding. Sometimes I thought. Hey, Sebastian. What's his name? Seabiscuit. <laughs> I'm like Sebastian Buck. I love that. Same he thing. is brought up every 10 minutes. Hey, Seabiscuit. That'll. How's the derby? <laughs> See in Kentucky. And the toilet bowl. Stay float. Stay. That's too heavy to float. Too heavy. <laughs> That's like go. All right, let's bring me to my next thing. Ghost poops, y'all got them. Where they disappear. <laughs> what about when you don't have to wipe and it's just clean? Not the clean. God, I'm glad we're having this conversation. These are the things clean. I would have taken to my grave. Do you ever chance very... it when you know it's a clean one? You're like, I'm not wiping. I don't ever trust that it's a clean one, ever. You just just let it sit there in, in the in the grand illusion that it's gonna be <laughs> like some sort of car wash back there. I, you I ain't think got I nothing. wipe, but I I always want to not. You know, I <laughs> I know I know I don't need to waste one square of this poor tree soul on this one in particular. I mean, I feel. But bad I'm gonna do two it. squares and check. Just do a little tap. I was right. I was right. You tap. You dab it like you do the side. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See if you come up. Hey, <laughs> come up clean. Come up clean. Then you That's wipe, crazy. Then you, then you wipe your nose with it. <laughs> <laughs> and then you go do produce at TJ's. And I didn't wash my you hands. Didn't wash, wash your, your hands. produce, cocksuckers. That's what I thought. You're like, we had to clean the toilets and then go do produce. I was yeah. like, wow, was there a hand washing <laughs> no. process that there intercepted you're that? To. I never did. Nasty. I'm just kidding. I brought, I'm going to Whole Foods. I kidding. did. I actually was quite clean. Despite everything about me, Dr. Bronner's peppermint hemp oil soap. I was the only sane person in there that would open and spoil a bottle for us to use because they'd use that foam shit that didn't work at all. They got the, they got cheap on the soap. They buy this cheap soap and you it wouldn't the air, lather. Air it wouldn't foam. lather. Is that air foam? Yeah, air but foam? you know some foam works, some foam doesn't. This foam doesn't fucking work. You brought your own Dr. Bronner. I brought my own. Too, a little yeah, because they talk shit. I'd spoil a bottle for the staff to use on their hands, to have clean hands. And then they talk shit. I'm like, it's for us, you dumb fucks. And then I was like, all right, I'll bring my s- own bottle. I'll bring my own little bottle then. 
Uh -huh. I ain't using your soap. Your soap don't work. Have fun with the pink eye. Uh -huh. Joe. Joe. <laughs> He's right. Now, did they, did they think that you were stealing inventory when you took the thing? No, for because the rest I left it in set? the break room for all to use. It didn't come I think home that's with very me. Very courteous. Of it you. didn't come home with me. Yeah, I drink a little on my lunch break. You know, just a little nip of the Doctor Bronner's. Yeah. Are you familiar with that product? You I know that. Like yeah, oh, I'm right. not a hippie. Yo, you what is like it about? Why my hair? Yeah. I get this shit all the time. It's <laughs> fucking crazy. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I don't. I do. I get that a lot. Like, you smoke weed. I'm like, bitch, just because <laughs> I don't look like I have a hairbrush does not mean I smoke weed. You got 19 years? 19 That's fucking crazy. years. That's crazy. And I still look like I smoke weed. There is something <laughs> wrong. I, had, I guess it's just my vibe. I don't know. It's cool. I don't know. I mean, like, it is. I weird. had eight years, and people did not believe me. I'd be like, no, I don't smoke. They go, yeah, right. I I'm mean, like, but you're real chill. I'm like, what do I, I don't, I don't care if I did, I would be like, I'm not lying. Who would lie about something so stupid? Feeling sober. Because it's, like, it's looked at as very cool. That's like, no. Yeah. They would not. A lot of people would not believe me. Like, you smoke. <laughs> okay. But you smoke, though. Like, yeah. no, I just talk like that. <laughs> yeah. I, and, yeah. I got dropped on my head as a kid. What do you want from me? Yeah. A matter of fact, this is an embarrassing story. This is a long time ago. Like a lot. Okay, so I wear glasses, and when I don't wear glasses, my eyes get very like squinty because they're just dry and small. So I did. Um, what was the stand up show? Last Comic Standing. This has had to be like 12 years ago. It was a long time ago. I, I was so nervous. Anyway, I went and did the stupid audition when it was like three minutes, and now I want to kill myself. So I went off stage, and afterwards, they put you in this little booth where they interview you. And the first question they said, they're like, Are you high? I was like, oh my god! No, <laughs> I was sober as fuck. I was like, wow! Like I think, and I think it was just because I wasn't wearing my. I don't know what, but I, I, I don't know. I have contacts. That was a long and they, story they get, for no payoff. No, yeah. it's all right. Yeah, I don't. I, I, I come right late. I had contacts that get dry, and so when I was now I smoke weed, but when I was not, I'd be like this with dry <laughs> eyes, and I look like this, and then they'd be like, "Craig's high," and I'm like, "No, it's contacts. They fucking annoying." Yeah. But now I'm high, so they were right. They were wrong for uh, fucking seven years, nine months. I think I made it 100%. 10 months. Something's got to give. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. It did. did you ever do Last Comic Standing? Mm -mm. You didn't? Mm -mm. Do they still do that? I believe Last it Comic Standing? stopped. I went did to a it? taping. A friend of mine was on it. Yeah. I can't wait till this industry fucks with me because the people have spoken. They come to the show and they come back. You do have a you have a lot you have a big following. Yeah, I go viral. A viral's nice. Oh shit. That was the one thing I saw your viral video. Virals. You know about the virals? Yeah. Oh, I saw the one that, that wasn't a, in the meme, the thing you said about dudes that like, guys will go 10 years of like a t friendship and they have not oh yeah not yeah, yeah. One photo together not that was inspired together. by our uh neighbor old brady a good buddy because i i was moving out I, w I was his neighbor i was his co-worker i known him about a decade and mm -hmm. we took a photo as i was like in the dark that came out terrible that his lady at the time made us take it wasn't even us it's like let me get a picture she had like a polaroid thing at the time you know this mm -hmm. is a few years ago and then uh and then I I just thought, like, I put it on my fridge, you know? Mm. I was like, that's the only photo <laughs> I have with him. And he's my good friend and neighbor and co-worker, and I've known him 10 years. And that is the only photo and his lady at the time. I don't want to get him in trouble. And, you know, uh, mm. it, that took it. That's crazy. That is so true. And the reason that shit went so viral is because every guy is like, oh, shit. And all the comments underneath it, like, I've known my buddy 22 years. We ain't got one fucking photo together. <laughs> it's so true. And girls, meanwhile, will have 49,000 together <laughs> of, on one night. On one night. <laughs> one night. That's just one angle, bitch. Yeah, like, we I know. get, oh my God. Guy, we're so different. Because we're we'll, built so different. It's awesome. I do. I do enjoy it. No, Some of the stuff. Yeah. No, it's good because I, I saw that because in, so there was like some dude Instagram page that took it 
and didn't credit you. Oh yeah, that's the worst. I saw that whole thing. It's it baffles me. Which is bullshit. But I'm glad you they did they ever did they ever No, no, and they continue to do it with other uh comedians and creators online and it's it's insane to me. I'll say it one more again. These stupid big conglomerate fucking memes factories some of them credit you and it's lovely it's awesome you get mm -hmm. credit you get followers and you're like it's good mm -hmm. it's good i want you and some of them screenshot it so they just leave your name off of it and you're like it's harder to to do what you did and and it's you're an asshole it's so easy to win we both win i never understood that that mentality and then i call them out and talk shit mm -hmm. and then people come at me like it's fucking twitter bro i'm like if if they just give me credit, two people win. And if they don't, they step on one and one person wins. Mm -hmm. Like, what do you not see? Like, it's, it baffles me. It fucking, that mentality of just, it's just a crabby, crab world. It's like, it doesn't have to be that way, you idiots. Everything could be easier and we all could help each other out. Mm -hmm. Peace and love, baby. Yay! Ashwagandha. It's the truth. Ashko Wazanda. Ashko Wazanda. <laughs> it's the truth. It is the truth. It is the truth. I yeah. think if everybody like would just have respect and acknowledgement of one another, I think, I don't know. And I don't know what people gain by not doing that. If, hate, like just more, like why, and they wouldn't have me speaking this way. I'd be like, oh, thank you, whoever the fuck shared my shit instead of stole my shit. Right. It's a thank you instead of a fuck you. It's, uh, I don't understand it. I don't get it. It's like, I remember shit like that at Trader Joe's. People would not return their cart, and the place they would ditch the cart was further than the cart corral. Mm -hmm. I was like, so you just took extra steps to be a piece of shit. And then, and it's that's why I'm excited for humans to go extinct. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Boy, that went dark. <laughs> I like it. It all ends in dying. You're like, you know what? Time to go. That no, was, that's why but that's like that's just like one of those courteous things that not a lot of people do like it's like the thank you like if you let somebody in or if or, or if somebody lets you in give the fucking just give a hand dude just give just a little hand it doesn't take but a minute yeah but most people don't do it my voice can't get that. yeah <laughs> put your fucking cart back put the cart back but nobody I, I also understand i'm a logical pragmatic dude like if you're far as fuck and like i'm like oh, I've, I've, you know my foot hurts i don't want to but sometimes when it's further to do the wrong thing i'm just that's when i'm like <laughs> fucking kill your whole family <laughs> but it, you know yeah you're still an asshole if you're super far but i uh, actually understand that it's 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 baffling it's baffling remember when uh you're bringing me back. I'd be ringing people up, and and then <laughs> Trader Joe's, you take their cart. You know, you pull their cart, and you you swipe it. How many times you like? Oh, I'll ring you up, and they won't let go of the cart. You know, you're like, <laughs> give me your cart, sir. I'm trying, <laughs> and they're just like, hey. I'm like, I'm I work here. I'm ringing you up. <laughs> that would happen every day, every day, That's multiple crazy. times a day. When you Why? were at the register, yeah, because and you pull pulled the the, the yeah. foot end of their cart up to, to get bring the them up. stuff out, yeah, and they would be like, 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 I'd be like, let go. You <laughs> People can't let go of anything, dude. <laughs> no, they hold tight. Let go of their so fucking cart. That's why man. we have celium husk. <laughs> <laughs> People can't even let go of shit. That's what I'm talking about. There's shit everywhere. Multi-billion dollar industry, laxatives. Just to open it up. This. Just to open it up. I have some I'm Philip milk of magnesia. I think I'll take a swig of that. <laughs> a fan gave it to me and I, I forgot I love it. your fans give you vitamins they, they're they fucking great man they gave me a pipe I started smoking I this guy in Canada gave that. me a pipe smoking the home I saw that yeah just kidding <laughs> um I saw it no it's cool it's cool they gave your fans me know you. Phillips um, milk of magnesia diarrhea medicine they gave me poo poo tea stickers they're fucking lovely coasters they gave me these coasters with my face oh on it. shit you didn't make those no look dead light these. visions did That's we've talked about them about. a bunch look at that who made that for you on the back dead dead light visions from what what state mm. that seems like in oregon washington <laughs> that I, seems some like woodsy california nah i have no idea you don't remember anyway whatever artist did this is beautiful that's great 
That's definitely this, some a fan shit. made this sign for me. Shut up, dude. I got his name right here. Look at you. Crushing. Who needs Trader Joe's? Yeah, I don't. Who needs Trader Joe's? I don't. Are you showing me who made the sign? No, Sadie should be here any minute. I'm excited. She, Sadie's a huge fan of yours. And now you're a fan of Sadie's, which it her. blows her fucking mind. I love her. Yeah, she's great. It's because what she does is so baffling to me. I'm kind of the opposite. Like, people are like, what's your sign? I'm like, I don't, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, uh, you know, I go off of like what people tell me it is or whatever. But like when people are like, "Oh, it's Virgo season," I'm like, "Oh." Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but people are really in tune to it. The crystals. I mean, I just I don't know. I was born like real basic, I guess. I love so, no. I love all that shit. I don't yeah, really understand it either. I like I don't. I only it. know my sign. I don't. I mean, I know the rest. I don't know what they mean and how. I don't pay attention. I just like it and enjoy it. And I, I like anything it, yeah. mystical. Like, I love all this weird shit, you know? Yeah, yeah. It's Jake. Jake Podcast Sign Guy is his last name, though. I don't know his official last <laughs> name. Jake, wait, I looked in the initial text. You didn't send me your first and last name out the gate. And that's a thing people need to practice. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And I'm going to go over texting pet peeves. Okay, these are texting lessons. If you send an address, send it alone separate don't bury it in the in the middle of a nine That's paragraph so then he, and then you can't click and then i'm copying and pasting and then it goes into my google maps and yeah. it's like hi you know it's like oh and same thing with phone numbers yep, yep. and then this one's not that bad but if you're in new friends with somebody first and last name mm -hmm. you know jake podcast hang guy you know i don't i wish i knew his last name but he made this for me and i love him because it's so nice <laughs> Because the first sign, not so much. I don't remember. It was paper mache and That's it was flapping down. Okay. The, the eye disappeared and the M flapped down. And it's in my garage. It's a sad sight. It also was blue. It was supposed to be green. M. Night Shyamalan. We all start somewhere. You know what I yeah. mean? We all start somewhere. Yeah. I'm glad you mentioned that about the hot links. <laughs> hot links? Of addresses and phone Isn't numbers. that infuriating? Because then you got to go copy paste and you try to copy paste it, but then it copy paste the whole goddamn the whole paragraph. Fucking thing. Or, then, or then you're doing the little like, let me just get the ass and <laughs> shrink it. And then you just, and you go, oh! Yeah. Copy, it's copy like, all. Paste, paste, select all. You're like, bitch, shut up. And then it makes you low key kind of hate the person that sent it. A just bit. a little bit. Not like, a lot, but like 4%. Work. You're like, I fucking hate this guy. We've just. Not, got he it. didn't do it. He didn't do it. <laughs> this last name is different. That's like, Point two percent. Yeah. Like, hey, it's just because I want to know your last name. That's all. And the other thing is, is like, oh, battery. Oh no, only problem. Battery no last so long. How long have we been talking? How long does long it usually time. last? Oops, oh, about an hour and a half. The podcasts are usually like an hour and a half, right? Yeah, yeah. hour to hour and a half. Um, Depending that was data from Goonies. Did you hear that? It sounded racist. Cause he, oh, no, oh, no. Remember? Oh, yeah. His uh, bully yeah. blinders. Which, the inventor. And the bully dad. blinders, and he pulls them out, and then it goes dark. And the goes, bully oh, no. Oh, no, no. Only bully. problem okay. battery don't last so long. <laughs> <laughs> I'm obsessed. He that was we've the got best. Two Data. Goonies, three, three Goonies references. Oh, we keep going. We I keep could going. Go Slick on shoes. Are you crazy? Slick shoes. <laughs> Slick, slick shoes. No, you see, these bullies were following me home, and 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 I made this, and then slick shoes. Slick shoes. How dope he puts is the that? oil on the log, and, and then the <laughs> and then the guy you rang up and went and fell on his old nutsack. Fell on, went, his, oh! on his nuts. <laughs> fell on his nuts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My favorite is when they were sticking chunks of hand into the blender. Yeah. And you tell them about fat camp. Oh my <laughs> God. In. in first grade, I've, I pushed my sister Edie down the stairs and I blame the dog. <laughs> Good. Never won an Oscar. I took my uncle's grandpa, grandpa's toupee and. What was that one? I don't remember what he did. And, I, and I glued it to, to Moses' face in, in my Hebrew play. And, and <laughs> Truffle shuffle. So good. They glued, yeah, they glued. Remember, dude, they glued. Corey, was it Corey Feldman? No, no, it wasn't. Corey. Corey. Corey, no, Corey Haim. Corey Haim. Fuck, oh, Corey Feldman. Corey, Corey Haim. Corey Haim is dead. Dead. He died. Yeah. And then Corey Feldman. Corey Feldman is still alive. 
Yeah. Did you watch his documentary? No. It's dark. I, I want know. to though. I like that shit. It's yeah. dark. It's about the industry and Hollywood and how they treat child actors. They fucked that boy up. Though. They f- they, fuck they fuck, fuck that boy those up. boys is what they do. It's crazy. He talks about it. Now it's, I gotta watch it. Yeah, it's. Uh, but I was yeah. upset. Lit. But that. But those two, Corey Haim, Corey Feldman, they were. They were centerfolds in Bot Magazine when oh, I yeah. was a schoolgirl, dude. <laughs> License we, to drive? Woo! Oh, oh, my God. On. We would sit Silver at those bullet. tables waiting waiting for our second bus. And we would sit there like little porn addicts. I had, I had, of I had Tiffany and Punky Brewster, and uh-huh. she had big tits. And I was like, when I was a kid, you know, I was like, Punky was the hot the hot thing that's crazy yeah punky brewster punky brewster could you imagine kids now thinking punky brewster is hot <laughs> well when you're eight and she's 10 you're like wow older woman <laughs> <laughs> just the, it's you know what i mean with social media like it's crazy Who else was, oh uh topanga on boy meets world that was a childhood crush what's some more what about little rose from rose jennifer love hewitt oh for oh, sure shit. can't hardly wait Party of Five, I think. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Party Neve five. Campbell. That was old school. Was it 90s Neve or crushes. Nev? See, I know. Oh, shit. Nev. You, you learn when you learn. I thought it was Nev. Um, what's the kid shit, though? Your kid, you watch it. Little Mermaid. Yeah. Yeah. Jessica cartoon? Rabbit. I was oh, attracted like to cartoons. cartoons. Cartoon. Bugs Bunny when he was hiding from Elmer Fudd and he turned into a woman. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> Look at those Sorry, lips. <laughs> you know? <laughs> that was a boner alert for sure. That's a, that's the real. That should be what people are talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Behind closed doors, yeah. what's happening? Yeah. So I think it's very normal. Yeah. For so, young boys to be attracted to Bugs Bunny when Bugs put on a, a wig, and they're like, Yeah, there's nothing wrong. With you that. still know that's Bugs, but. <laughs> but hey, something's stirring down under. <laughs> something's stirring. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm, and Jessica Rabbit, that bitch has lived on for twenty. I mean. She's so hot. She's the hottest. She's the hottest cartoon ever drawn. Hands down. For sure. Hands down. Mm-hmm. That walk. Her waist I'd marry was bigger her than if she pinky. was real. But she's not. <laughs> I mean. We'll give it time. We'll know. We'll fucking. They'll make an AI cartoon. Jessica Rabbit. You been to Comic Con? I mean because. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen her walking around. I'm just saying. Real life. Real life. Okay. So, so anyway. I say all that to say. Corey Feldman. We were talking about the Goonies part when he he super glued the the statue of David. Oh yeah, his yeah. ding ding on upside, upside down. down. <laughs> and he said, "If God if God made them that way, we'd all be pissing in our faces because <laughs> it's just straight up." <laughs> There's so many jokes I missed as a kid when the when the dick so falls good. off and yeah. they're like, "Oh my God!" And then <laughs> and then one of the kids like, "That's your mom's most favorite piece." <laughs> and then one of the kids says, "I think it's Corey Feldman." He goes. Wouldn't be here if it wasn't. <laughs> and it's when you're a kid, you say those jokes, you don't even get them. You're like, oh, shit. Yeah. That's awesome. None of them. None of them. I'm excited for you to meet Sadie, my lady. I think Me I heard too. her come in, but we still have one more question. And you know what it is, girl. I do. You, yeah, I got, this is the only real interview question. How are you? No, uh, <laughs> I need a good poop story when you shit your pants on a hot date with your wife. Your your man, your fucking know, whatever the fuck. Can be any of them, can it? <laughs> That's the truth. It's That's with the whatever. Truth. I've been with all of it. A good it. hot diarrhea story down I've the old leg. I've been with all of it. I'm trying to think. Does it have to be with a with a, you, wait. a hot date? Because I've definitely shit my pants. Oh, wait, I, before we get to, I used. To, I felt. Wait, are you go, with Jen? I am. Okay, you can yeah, ask yeah. me anything. I oh wish my god, would I ask love her. Money. People skate around this shit. I love like, her. Just... She took the most badass photos of us. That she evening. did. She's a very. She's her awesome. fucking lady is a brilliant photographer and like, I didn't even know this. She took my photo at Tammy's show and then like the next week she's taking photos of Ozzy and I was like, what? I was like, you weird. fucking went from me to the Prince of Darkness. <laughs> like, I mean, but she was always taking rock star photos. Yeah. And then COVID happened, and and then obviously, then she got stuck with old boy over here. <laughs> she went, she, yeah, so cool. Look her up, Jen Rosenstein. Stein. Stein. Rosenstein. It happens all the time. And yeah. Nev no, she's Campbell. she's in Nev. <laughs> Nev. And Silim Husk. Nashka Hawanda. <laughs> <laughs> I hope nobody's listening to your podcast trying to learn English. Mm-hmm, they are. This is not the podcast. Not this episode. 
Not this episode. <laughs> there's been a lot. There's been a lot of. <laughs> 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 They should make that the car horn sound. Yeah, they ooh, should. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. Shady! Shady! Oh, that's a cat. Mister! I'm just thinking, you know what? The world could do a lot. They could they could nickel and dime their way into helping people make things a little funnier around here. Like even making the car horn. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> or like just little shit. You know everything that has an audio like the rock, <sighs> like the crosswalk thing? I missed them. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know a bird Just chirping. Who wants a bird? Oh, I want to hear. Ooh, 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 <laughs> cross, cross, cross. <laughs> Crape lady, fall, cross. You know what I'm saying? Cross. But you know how, like, on your map, like, on the, you can make the voice whatever you want it to be. Like, you can make it like a, you can make an Australian dude. You can. I have a South a, African woman. Right. I don't want. I don't want no regular English yeah, man telling right? me what to do. Right. Get the fuck out of here. Turn left at the light, Craig. <laughs> that sounds soothing. Mr. Cat, get back in here. I just feel like you should. we should spend a little extra time and Enjoying, money Enjoying, yeah, in free parking, a little less. A little more interesting. Yeah. Did Sadie walk in? That was Mr. Cat, but she's here. So we got to get Remember your Remember how started. I called you? how I called your cat Sadie? Yeah. <laughs> I looked at human level. I was like, Sadie! And it was a cat. <laughs> <laughs> and then a cat walked in in a bow tie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get Mister in here, but yeah, tell us your poop story. All right, but okay, it's not amazing. It's not gonna be great, but any shitting of the pants story is pretty good. <laughs> All right, it was over pandemic. It was during the whole quarantine thing, and I was trying to be healthy, like you know, going to like a health kick. <laughs> <laughs> Even June doesn't know stories. I didn't tell her. I've shit my pants twice being married to her, and I've told her one time. <laughs> So I guess this is my confessional because most likely she won't listen to this. But in case she does, yeah, we were. Um, hey, Mister Cat, do you want to hear a shit story? <laughs> Lock them in, Chris. I could to deliver this and just me telling your poop story and meows. Meow. Yeah, get over here. You're mine. That is a very handsome cat. Yeah, he's so cool. Has a bow tie. Okay. Look at his oh, his slick. Yeah, his slick face. He's my boy. It's just, I don't know if it's going to make it easier or harder to tell a shit story <laughs> while me. you're holding Why a can't cat. You tell me? I'm going to tell you. I'm just. <sighs> Are you ready, Mr. Cat? This is like some sort of weird Christopher Guest film. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Christopher Guest? Like, what? For real, for real? I don't know. Christopher Guest, who made, he's the director of all, like, uh, Best in Show, Waiting oh. for Guffman. Okay, yes. And then I know this man. I don't I don't know, like, the behind-the-scenes guys so much, even though I should, because they're the true geniuses to get the vision to come to life. Mr. Just stay with me. He, he loves this. He don't want to hear a shit story anymore. Yes, Anybody does. wants to hear a shit story. Is he farting or is that a meow? <laughs> he's got a condition. Did he fart? No, is that a fart? He's got a breathing problem. I want to say fort. <laughs> I like saying fort. <laughs> fort. It goes, it's so out of context with my actual accent. Fort. <laughs> I thought your fart? accent was a character this whole time. No. You're from Kentucky. I'm from Kentucky. <laughs> 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 Where did we go wrong, dude? I don't know. What? You're from Kentucky? I'm no, from... I know. I know. I'm just easy. I'm sorry. You're from Louisville. I'm the actually... Planet of the Tapes. Planet of the Tapes. Yeah, it's for, from... Okay, so let me just get it out. Okay. Okay. I'm getting frustrated with my own level of caffeine inside my system. I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I know I'm like sick of syringe of some sort of anti... Bodies. <laughs> Anti-anxiety yeah. serum into my... <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> Like, okay, you shit your pants. So I shit. Okay, I'm Dodge glad. Miss, okay, it's <laughs> super short. It's not that big of a deal. But I, so I was going through this health kick. We were like doing this juicing thing, <laughs> and part of this juicing thing, the there's also a soup called. It was cabbage soup. Poop your pants soup. I've had it. I've had it. <sighs> they might as well call it 
like shit syrup. Cause yeah. You, oh yeah. It starts bubble guts immediately. You start Ooh. getting bubble guts. Ooh, and yeah. so I was so I was like juicing and whatever. And then I had this cabbage soup, and I was outside. <laughs> you shit the lawn? No, man. <laughs> No, I didn't shit the lawn. I shit my pants. And um, uh. so it was similar to that bass that just came out of your throat. Oh. came out of my ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which I thought, this, this one bang is driving me crazy. So, <clears throat> so I knew my guts were bubbly, you know, but I thought it was just your regular juice you know that's meant what it's supposed to it's supposed to clean you out it's supposed to rip any organs you have that are loose <laughs> out of your asshole <laughs> and so i was outside going to take laundry <laughs> and i felt you know you have a little you know you should have a little boop boop <laughs> and so i just thought i had a little <sighs> oh no it's a big one <laughs> down the leg it was so moist it was, warm it was immediately <laughs> warm <laughs> oh oh i can tell the story because i'm married and i don't give a fuck anymore yeah. and i'm also you know what i mean you get to a point in your life where you're just like i don't give a fuck and so and i'm at that point <laughs> and so i shit in my pants craig i just shit but it was just it was it was like a little hershey kiss it was like whew, like a, a reverse hershey kiss <laughs> 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 just like a teaspoon of pudding you know like <laughs> wow that kind of makes me hungry <laughs> so it was about, yeah so it's like <laughs> anybody, anybody have any hostess you got a ding dong <laughs> yeah if you left in the sun too long got a cupcake just <laughs> <laughs> any, anybody got any thumbprints <laughs> Dude. What are those called with the little, you know, the little <laughs> shortbread cookies with the Hershey Kiss on top? Yeah. Thumb, thumbprint. That's right? what it looked yeah. like, just like I said in reverse. Yeah. Anybody have the upside down version of a thumbprint? Anybody have the Stranger Things cookies I'm looking <laughs> for? <laughs> Somebody put a thumbprint in. <laughs> Anyone have a cookie made by the Dark Lord? <laughs> the Dark Lord. <laughs> uh okay yeah. i'm trying to make eye contact with you still that's okay that's good that's our poop story we did it well i mean that's yeah i mean that's kind of what happened and then you waddle oh you waddle shit. your ass back was in. your wife home yes and then and she didn't know you had to go straight to the toilet oh this has layers no i mean it's just it's the it's the timeline of what happens when you shit your pants yeah the company i'm gonna take another. a shower <laughs> did she just take one yeah i got 30 <laughs> you know yeah yeah yeah. you yeah. go in there's two doors to the bathroom and i went in i was <laughs> and you do that whole thing because now you have pudding in your pants so you you don't want it and at least but i did have lady drawers on nice you know what i yeah, didn't yeah. i wasn't wearing boxers it didn't, didn't it didn't do half, the electric you know? slide down my leg like fucking that one. <laughs> create a tectonic plate you know <laughs> yeah it was i don't like know i was trying to be clever <laughs> underwire for your your butthole just caught it it caught it like a how they have dam catchers that catch comforting. all the leaves yeah <laughs> in the storms yeah. in the great storms so in the great storms of my asshole i got caught it got caught good old calvin it did its Klein. job calvin thank klein you. did his job thank you yeah so and then we just you know you brittily remove it so nothing <laughs> spills out one way or the other and then you throw them the fuck away you throw them away and slap like them on the wall had... leave your mark <laughs> <laughs> who did you... that i don't know <laughs> my territory and then i made it art yeah because i'm an artist <laughs> and i ran out of paint and i'm a creator that's what kids do they run out of crayons <laughs> <laughs> they write with their turds <laughs> mm -hmm. i'm glad i wasn't at least that kid you never wrote with your turds? Did mm. you ever but did you ever shit in the bathtub? And then and then a little float log. And you're like doo -doo -doo. Maybe once. I, I definitely did. pissed in there still. <laughs> so I did. That's classic. I don't think you can make it to full blown adult without at least letting out a poop log once. Did you poop in the tub? I, I did. I can't remember. I feel like I must have. It's a thing. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what I mean. I'm I'm trying to go backwards and be as free as a kid. My cousin so pooped pooping. in the toilet with her older brother, and he went to grab it because he thought I was Chewbacca. It was Star Wars was big back then. They're older than me, you know. 
and uh Chewbacca. and then his mom saved him like no that's a turd everybody <laughs> out yeah he's like oh have you seen the food fighters new music video with chewbacca no man like with a poop log in the pool it's nasty <laughs> oh, they always shout make out funny to the foos no it's hilarious it's th- in a the guy from T- i can't remember, say it, pronounce his name right so i'm just gonna say the main dude from ted lasso have you seen ted La- have jason segufis yeah i can't ever say his. it just sounds like chicago it's a, a chicago <laughs> sausage sub that's what it, his last name <laughs> i gotta watch like it to i hear good thing you haven't seen it Mm-mm. have you seen it yeah Sudeikis. Sudeikis. Thank you. That's, That's what I said. He, looked, he should be at like a Chicago Bears game. That's what he remembered. Sudeikis. 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 Man, he was high for his Inception speech. Inception. Exception. Ex- Inception. <laughs> I was like, what kind of underground fucking... Do you see him? He's like, yeah, I'm just, nah, nah. he's fucking... He smoked a joint and was on a Zoom award show and didn't think he was going to win. And then he did. And he was like, oh. <laughs> for real? For real, for real. Watch that. It's hilarious. I didn't You're like, that. oh my God, that motherfucker just smoked a joint. He, he was made high no sense. At the live one, too. Oh, he was? He won again and he was really high. Nice. How could you tell? His eyes. Really? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Were they red? All slouchy? Mm hmm. <laughs> Lazy eyes? <laughs> Glossy eyes. Glossy. 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 He closed on Melrose. That was my favorite makeup pop up store. This is bullshit. This Gla- is bullshit. Glossy. Glossy. Hey. Glossy. Glossy. French for glossy. The flounch. It's flounch. Must be flounch. Must be flounch. <laughs> Again. Must be Italian. Fragile. Fragile. Must be flounch. Another one of the greatest okay. movies of all time. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. I think we've about done it. I'm losing my marbles right here. Must be flounge. <laughs> Thank you for your poo poo story. I, I mean, it was it was subpar. That's good. It no. was subpar. I mean, it was in my adult That's life. That's a poop story. Some people don't ago. have them. That's subpar. Who doesn't have a poop story? Are they not I'm disclosing saying. it? Or are they not telling the full yeah, truth? Yeah. Let it out. <laughs> Tell everybody. That's the problem, though. Everybody's keeping everything too tight to their chest. That's some bullshit. Everybody's all walking around. You ain't cool unless you shit your pants. That's what I say. If shit in your pants is cool, then I must be Miles Davis. That's an improvised line of Billy Madison. That should be your new merch. Out with Lucy Goosey. Ah. Out with the whatever you just said about shit in your pants. (laughs) I already forgot it. I agree. it It was catchy. It was catchy at the moment. I know people would appreciate it. I got a pee pee. Again. I know, I'm a pisser. Your holes are loose. Too I'm many psyllium husks. <laughs> Loosey goosey. You got too much psyllium husk. All your holes are <laughs> spread out. Um. Anyways, we got to wrap this up. Thank okay. you so much for tuning in to Community Services. Sarah Highland, check her out. Sarah yeah. Highland Rosenstein. Just Sarah Highland. I know, it's been very confusing. I've had like 18 different names. It's very confusing, Jeez. but just Sarah Highland. Okay. Yeah. We'll tag you in all the things. Check her out. Oh, She's yeah. hilarious. Thanks. Check dude. out her YouTube channel. I can't talk. YouTube. We'll tag you. My plural channel. Must be flaunch. Oh, boy. <laughs> I love you all. Thank you for subscribing and liking. And thank you for showing up to my shows. I see you. You fools are showing up. God bless you. You're coming out. You guys are dope. Thank you. Thank you. Peace. Thank you. Bye.